Hello. Hi. Everybody. Hi. <laughs> Hello. We were just sitting here going, ugh, that's not even working. That's not working. That's not working. Yeah. Apparently Facebook again crapped out on the old restream, which is like an once every five or six times. I mean, we don't have a lot of people that watch us on Facebook or we whatever, but that's okay. And we like them to feel welcome and they're not. We do. Um, yeah. And then also, and then the counter is not working mm. either. I just, I love. I love technology. It's just how things go, you I know? I feel like I love them more than it's Kip. It's all like go. More than Kip. Uh, hello, wow. Better Half. Hello, Loopy. Hello, Chadley. Chadley, uh, Chadley William. Better Half finally remembered to watch us at the beginning of the stream. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> That's nice. I'm glad. Uh, Loopy is looking forward to seeing Meadow. Um, yeah, Yar. Yar. Whoops. Oh. There, there it, it is. is. All done. <laughs> That's all you get. That's all you get. Um. Okay, Valerie says, hello, everybody. This game looks really adorable. Can't wait to see how it plays. We love this It is adorable. Game. You are correct. And when I posted on it the other hello, day. Leon. Oh, Leon. Oh, Beyond Dead 13. Molly, hello. Molly. Can't um, wait to see Meadow as well. Well, you saw it. You know what I noticed? <laughs> Beyond Dead 13 always posts those two little, I don't know, what is that? Is Dolphins. it a shark? Dolphin? With a little wave. It looks like a pink-haired, like, sea star. That's what I always think it is, but it's not. It's not. It's not. Um, they live right by Gold's Gym. Wh who lives right Beyond by Gold's Dead. Gym? Beyond Dead. How do you know that? He said something the other day. What? Yeah. Wait a second. Beyond I Dead know. is someone that we that lives by us? By Gold's Gym? <sighs> That's what Our I, If Gold I gym? remember, yeah, from what I, yeah. I feel it's so you weird right now. I had Beyond. no idea. Yeah, yes. Beyond, yes. See? <gasps> yeah, isn't that crazy? Whoa, I didn't know that. That's amazing. I invited, um, I invited them to our um, Lake Country group. Well, my friend, oh. uh, Mr. Beery, is Lake Country group that yes. we are also a part of. Yeah, that's great. Uh, hello, Jogas. Oh, Jogas. Jogas. Uh, played Metal for the first time last night. I think it has to be on one of my favorite games. Yes. Yeah, it's really good. It shot up to my hello, top Hello, Mirren from Serbia. Yes. Oh, scroll up a tiny bit. Uh, Loopy, no, everybody was not kung fu fighting. Surely not everybody was kung fu fighting. <laughs> my mom got this for Randy for his birthday yes. last month, so she thought it was pretty funny. So do I. Um, Leon, I'm glad that <sighs> uh, a positive was made out of a negative for that. Oh, yes, Health scares, definitely. but it's a pure blessing as we finally found the root cause of the medical issues. So that's awesome. That's Root causes Sometimes, are awesome. Sometimes, you know, it just takes so, like, multiple doctors or, I mean, I don't know what your situation is, obviously, but multiple trips, multiple yeah. doctors, and, like, a certain thing to happen before somebody's like... This is yeah, what it is. Yeah, figured it out. I know. Yeah, my dad. So I'm really a lot of happy weird that you that uh, were able to figure that out. Um, somebody said they're here watching from Maine. Yes. And that's awesome. And I want to go to Maine. I want to visit it. Get some lobster. Some lobster. lobster from Maine. Is that how they talk out there? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. Hi, Nathan. They've got a little bit of a uh, Boston type thing going on there. I think I you're right. Yeah, anyway. Okay. Uh, Nathan, hi everyone on screen and in chat. All looking good. Hello, Nathan. Hello, Madison. Oh, this is fun. I have never caught you guys live. I only get to watch the play, guys. Welcome. I am so glad, Madison, that you were able to watch We are so watch us glad then. you are here. That's awesome. Oh, you, you, you were? Oh, beyond geez. Dead? Who what the a... heck are you? Who are How you? How did I not put all that together? Thank you, Loopy. Literally have no idea who you are. Hello, Mrs. Stern. 
Oh, on Twitch this oh, time and not YouTube. Mrs. Stern. Wow, that is very <laughs> How official. formal. <laughs> did you choose? Did you choose that name, Chrissy? For I'm your one of the Twitch? few people Mrs. who have Stern. never had Facebook. That's fine. <laughs> that is crazy. Um, I didn't have a Facebook until we had a photography business, and then kind of you have to if you have a business. So, hey, Bum Fuzzle, yes. I haven't said your name in a while. Hope you're doing great. More unboxing, oh, see, please. We came together connected. Oh, now. good. Okay. Okay. As you were very upset. Apparently, about it. it says it did. Joe Don Richardson. Oh my gosh! Look at all these um, names that I haven't seen in a while. <sighs> Guys, hello, 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 hello. Hey, more unboxings, boxings, please. You know we love doing unboxings, but you know yeah. what? We don't get all that many <laughs> games for free. They cost money. To so do. they cost money, obviously. <laughs> they cost money to do them. Uh, yeah, but we, we love, love doing, doing those. Them. Um, yeah. We are doing an individual unboxing of almost every one of those that uh, yes. was on that video. Yes. Not quite as surprising as like a brown box that you open and go, oh, it's that. But, but it's still um, cool to see what's inside of it. We do have some of those coming out give it the smell test. You see how are those a smell smells. tester. And uh, we recorded like three videos in one go, so we're wearing the same clothes for the next I four videos. I don't think anybody cares. That bothers me. <laughs> I like different Loopy outfits. just played our first game of a Agropolis or Agripolis. Agripolis? I have never heard of that. Very cool, cool very tiny, cool, tiny game. game. One by one point. Hmm. Sweet. That's awesome. Is it a Louis? tiny game with tiny amounts of points? Like, is it tiny? tiny? Like, do you mean like it's small? <laughs> Hello, Joe this Don. Uh, Zoo? <laughs> Nathan says, Loopy, it may seem like someone is Kung Fu <laughs> fighting because their kicks are fast as lightning. <laughs> that is true, Nathan. <laughs> That's a great shirt. Centarine. I will be wearing that at some point. Hey, all new here. Excited about this game. Hello, Zoe. Zoe Boone. Uh, this is a great game, That's and cool it's a good kind of middle of the road weight wise. Yes. And it looks absolutely, absolutely. fantastic. Fantastic. Yep. We love it. Maine is kind of like Wisconsin. There's some popular area, but there's a lot of forest woods nature towards the north. Totally. Yeah, towards Canada. Canada. Yeah. Totally. Hey. Mrs. Stern. She said uh, I sure hello, did because she chose that name. What? I said, did you choose that name? Like you uh. decided to call yourself Mrs. Stern on Twitter. She's like, I sure did. <laughs> Good evening, James. Uh. Nathan, everyone, I haven't watched Randy and Ellen's unboxing video yet. Please, no spoilers. Well, this one's not in it. <laughs> 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 I'll spoil one. <laughs> uh, gold gems on water. I used to live out, what, over there? Just moved to Greendale a month ago. Oh. Uh, Gold's gym in Waukesha. Wacky Shay. I think um, you mean Wacky Shay. Wacky Shay. Um, so, yeah, the Gold's gym over in Waukesha off of, uh, what is that, Northview? I have no idea. That Guys, I don't know any street names. Summit. Summit. Lived here Summit. my whole life. Um, if you ask directions from me for Hope Waukesha, I will not know. I was I so close I to you guys. I didn't know that, Valerie. Know. What the heck? Why didn't we game together? <sighs> you should move back. You should move. You should move back so we can game, and then you can move back. Again. The game only has eighteen cards. That is a tiny game, Loopy. Oh, well, it is tiny. Haha! Uh -huh. We did a big batch of filming not long ago, and <laughs> realized we will, we will be wearing the same clothes for the next several videos too. <laughs> Doesn't you know, that bother happens. you a little bit? I like a new look every time because it yeah. just looks fresh and. Like... If you do it, then I usually bring down some yeah. shirts. I guess I but, forgot. I totally yeah. forgot. I was really oh tight. Tina oh, or John. John. <laughs> <laughs> roses uh, check oh roses so it must be tina and john in between canadian olympic glory oh uh, yeah this is a button shy okay, yeah i don't sense. this is just a thing because it, she happens to be canadian but there's a diver that got a 0, 0.0 score in her dive because you know how you're supposed to dive head first yeah she screwed something up and she went feet first. No, into the pool. are you serious? Oh I mean, my God. I'm not laughing at her. Okay? No, that's it's not funny at all. No, but it's funny. That's not funny. <laughs> I mean, wait a second. Okay. I feel absolutely and utterly terrible for her. Obviously, did she miscalculate her flipping in the I, air? And I want to watch like, the. Dive. I want to watch the video, but they show her like right above the Crazy. water as like stick oh, straight no. up as you can get. Oh. Yeah. Anyway. Well. Oh, it's a button shot. Okay. Well, I do that. I didn't know it was a button shy game. That makes Ooh, a lot more sense. Oh, Madison lives in Canada. A. Oh, hey, I live in Canada. A. Right, we just keep reading the same comments out loud okay, to fine. each other back You want to read it? You do it. No, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> um, Leon got to play Root this weekend a few times, play both moles and the lizards. Hate to admit it, mm, but the lizards are definitely my play style. I have not yet played that game. I would mind. I would like to play uh, <sighs> at some point. Hey, John and Tina. Tina, is this? I don't, I'm not going to click the link don't right click now, it. but I'm pretty sure, I don't Who know if that's in that response is. to what we're talking about with the diving. Um, ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -bum -bum. Loopy, did the Dice Tower mention something about having a Magic the Gathering stream tomorrow? I didn't see that, so I can't help you. 
Oh, no, Ever visit Miami? Can things. stay by beach house and game all day. I have amazing. been to Miami a few times. And uh, I have not. we are going to Miami for the Dice Tower Retreat yeah. in September. So we will be Super there once excited. again. It will be my fourth time in Miami. I, my zeroth time. Zeroth. Yep. Hello. Did I miss the gameplay? Hello, headbanging man. You did not. No. We just went live a few minutes ago and we're going through all of the chat. We have yeah, a very we're vocal chat today. I know. I love it. Look at all you guys. Hey, John Wheeler. Hello, John. Wheeler. Wheeler. Um, oh, yeah, that's John. You, you got to say first and last I gotta name. I got to say Wheeler. Ever since you Called pointed you out, John, that I, I know that I didn't say your last <laughs> name. I'm like, I got to say the guy's last name. Plus, your last name is just fun to say. So why wouldn't you say Wheeler? Honestly. Uh, she mistimed oh. her jump and split-second choke decision fail versus potentially injury. Or, oh. Yeah. No, you know I mean, what? Then respect. Yeah, it was just a three-meter really cool. It was a three meter dive, which is roughly ten feet. Um, Sounds horrifying. But yeah, I mean, obviously that kind of crap can happen. Yeah, right? Joe Guz, we gotta play some games, bro. Come on now, come I'll on. Host a root game sometime in Franklin. Okay, I'll be there. I'll be yeah, there. Yeah, Joey. Mm -hmm. Speaking of Dice Tower events, will you guys go to Dice Tower West? I would really, no. really, I really want to go. Where it? Sure. Where, where is it? And when? Vegas, is it? and it's usually like in the springish time. I forgot it's oh. March, I think. We'll see, maybe. Um, from Wisconsin, it's My one of the most... My voice high means nope. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, why not? I don't know. It's in the spring, we can't... <sighs> I don't know. Um, not that this is a complete deterrent, but um, the plane tickets to Vegas are like one of their most expensive from Wisconsin to Las Vegas in that time frame. Did not know that. Not that it's a huge deal, but it is like 300 some dollars last couple time, last couple of years I've checked, but... That's cricket. Anyway. Um, Mrs. Stern, I got to play metal for the first time yesterday and won. Huh, well, who'd you play with? Yeah, mm. that's right, Stern. <laughs> yes, you did. You won by one, first of all. Just so everybody knows, you won by one. So Chrissy is obsessed <laughs> with wildlife, and so every time a new animal came out, she would, like, freak out for probably, like, 30 seconds. Hilarious. Yes, Nathan. She loves it. Yes, she loves it. do that. Um, it would be my first time in Miami. I hate the heat and don't like the beach. So if it wasn't for the treat, I would probably never go. Well, you know, um, Tom yeah. um, keeps his event venues um, very cold with yeah, lots does. and lots of air conditioning. So Yeah, he does. Too um, cold, in my opinion. You could probably stay there and not Do have you remember a how cold yeah, the Vegas, baby, room right. was at Gen Con? March 2nd to 6th. I'm not sure if he, he probably... Could have controlled that. We had a church yeah. service at Gen Con, and it was, you guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he probably would have kept it. I was <laughs> shivering. <laughs> he, I'm likes like, Tom, his, he likes his room no. cold. <laughs> absolutely not. That's what I told him. I walked right up to him. I said, yeah, absolutely um, not. Yes, I heard that they changed it to the Rio. Yeah, 17 minutes from the strip. Yeah. I, I heard that they had moved it a little bit farther from downtown. Uh, they, just, <laughs> they discussed I didn't catch board game breakfast today. Ooh, look at that. Well, look what Loopy said. You've only not said it once. Played the night cage again tonight, and I just and barely lost. Again. So close. I really, really want to um, Don't, but play you. that game. Um, it looks super creepy, and Valerie um, asked. Oh how yeah, so I told Valerie we were going to talk about this earlier. Yeah, Can Nathan, you do that's overhead? what I was asking. It's on my mind. Overhead shot by one or one hundred. It a win is a win. That is absolutely right, headbanging maniac. <laughs> Oh, you want me to switch to... Yes, that's why Oops. I'm holding my switch. arm out like a crazy person. Switch to... Um, so, it's going cam. great. And actually, this is healing so much better than, like, even this one healed and this top portion. I don't know why. Maybe it's just <laughs> where it's at. But this is it, you guys. I got more leaves and flowers added here. As you can see, it looks a little darker. She touched up some stuff and then added this section because I want to be able to see flowers in the winter in Wisconsin because it's freezing nine months out of our year you here. you keep your sleeves up just a little yeah, bit. Yeah, and I always pull my sleeves up, so I wanted to, yeah. So I went a little crazy, and I love Over 6,000 games in the Dice Tower oh. West Library. That is right. They have a ton. That is for shizzle. Oh. Uh, oops, I was not done to see that. Uh, Giovanni says he can't hey, stay Giovanni. long tonight. That's okay. Oh. That's okay. Yeah. Just got the game Dark Ages from Kickstarter Pledge. I don't know why. Must be a glutton for punishment. Four hours or more. Four hour or more games seem to be the ones I buy the most. Well, that's fine. That's what you like. Yeah, you are a, a like comment reading fiend tonight. There's a soundtrack for the Night Cage that is super creepy sounding. I have heard that. I haven't heard it, but I heard that they have one, I should say. My lipstick's really bothering me. 
Do you need to get the news section shaded or is it done? You're done. Um, it's correct? done. It's done. Yeah. She said send her pictures of this portion in like six weeks. And based on what she sees, she'll be like, come back in and let's put it. It'll look a little more shaded once it um, settles in, right? After a couple of yeah, weeks. Yeah, because it kind of blends a little bit. So that's why this yeah. looks a little like fuller and expanded. And this is very tight line. This one's very still. stark, but yeah, it'll yeah. kind of like gray yeah. out, which will look more shaded. Yeah, she actually did it. She used gray black, not black black, which I don't know why. I think. She said something to match the other one. I think because of I how it. I where it know. is on the arm or something. I don't know. She knows what she's doing, right? So. She like just made that up. Probably can't handle Night Cage, but I suspect, depending on availability, it'll be in the top games of 2021. I can maybe see that, maybe. I'm probably going to. Yeah. It looks creepy. Thank you, Valerie. I love it so much. I don't have a tattoo, but love them on other people, and that's a beautiful <laughs> sketch. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's a big commitment. And honestly, once she put this part on, I looked down and I was like, that feels more complete than just up here. It feels complete and good, and I just, I love it. <laughs> We are Sorry. caught up on comments. Dang! So, okay, let us talk about the about giveaway. The oh, the quick. giveaway, yes. So we, listen guys, I gotta tell you this. I gotta tell you a story right now. This yeah, guy right reached here. out to us. Yes, Austin, whatever, what the heck is his last name? What's Austin's last name? Austin. He's the designer of this game, I have no idea. I'm terrible with names. <laughs> I know, it's so bad. Already. What the heck is his name? Uh, he Austin Harrison. Harrison, like Harrison Ford. Dang it, I can't believe I forgot that. He reached out, he's like, I'm gonna send you guys this game. You know, I want you to play it. So we did. And then we were like, we love it. We talked about it a lot. So he wanted to give us another copy so that we could do a giveaway a year ago. No, it hasn't it's been, been a long freaking time. Well, we were trying to figure out how we exactly Chappy. wanted to do everything. And then um, it kind of just completely got away from us. Well, life just got cray cray, which is such a such a like cliche excuse. But it did. So here we are. Yes. We're giving it away. We are giving it away. I swear um, we didn't keep it, Austin. In like, you know, 15 <laughs> minutes or so after we've gotten into the rules and stuff or whatever, we will give you instructions on how to win. Yes. Said Moonraker's game. This is hey, the Panic. Kickstarter exclusive edition. Guys, let me tell you a little something about this game. It's negotiation. Yes. It's a race to 10 points. Yes. In this game, you are filling out contracts. Yes. With other people or by yourself. Yes. Yes. It is the game that showed me that I love negotiation games. And we just played it at a mini convention that one of our friends held two weeks ago, a week ago. We played it until midnight. Everybody was done playing games. And they came around the table and were watching us finish out this game. And I won. You and did. it was amazing. You did win. It was, I was clawing my way to the top. And um, basically I threatened everybody and made them push me up into the 10 spot. Yeah, it's really, really good. Because I was good. like, you're not going to win. Help me I out. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. It's so got good. a bit of, it, it's not, it doesn't have a king making thing, but it's got one of those, like, you play to 10 points and you can kind of fluctuate on Hi, points Danos. as you go along. Danos. And it's one of those where everybody kind of creeps up to the top. Yeah. Because you're always kind of like self-regulating because you don't want other people to get too high because then they can just win. Totally. So, yeah. It's, upon it's upon completing cool little, contracts, cool you, yeah. if you worked with other people, you divvy out the points if there's a card, like a, like a free card you can get, and money. And the money is important because you can build parts for your ship and bring it into your own ship and then use those abilities throughout the game yep. which can help you climb up and up and up and there's objectives yep and there's deck building greatness and all that um it's yeah so the color good. schemes on this is really cool it's got this like dark bluish grayish yeah. like steel gray kind of a color yeah and um the colors really pop on the cards off very it. Super good. Hello, um, yeah so in about 15 ish minutes or so we will give you instructions on how to win yes and then uh, we'll give everybody X amount of time to get in their submissions. Yep. And then we will randomly select a winner. Yes, we will. So we will get to that in a bit here. Um, also, I just want to say the Instagram post that I made about that, the dang giveaway. Um, I made a whole thing. Okay, it was cute. It had music, sparklies, all that stuff. I posted it. And then, like, it kept not working. And when hmm. I went to repost it, I ended up just screenshotting it and reposted the screenshot. Oh, today? Yeah. Yeah. That <laughs> like was, the yeah, last three remember, things. Because I'm like, there. why is this not working? So it looked a little, looked great. A little junky. Steven, greetings and salutations. I got to work from home again on a Monday and got to catch you live. Excellent. We are so happy you, you are you with did. us. That's awesome. All right. So uh, well, let's get into Meadow. Yeah. Let's get into Meadow. Um, How do you like your falling skies? Oh, Excellent. that was so I've cute. i played two games so far. I've played one at the zero, so the easiest possible level. 
and then uh, with the easy or the original Roswell City. And then I played a second game immediately afterwards with Washington, D.C., and then Threat Level 2, which is, like, right in the middle of difficulty. So I think I might play, like, Hi, one Judy. game at, like, really hard difficulty Judy, Judy, just Judy. to see how that works out. And then I will start the campaign, which is, they say, is around 10 games or so. Wow. So I might play that live. I mean, there's some spoilers in the campaign, so, you know, people might not want to watch for that reason, I guess. But I might do that and just play, like, two or three games because it's pretty quick. Yeah. Like, two or three games at a time. And then maybe over a few nights, um, have the campaign <laughs> finished. I think, um, oh my gosh. Don't get Danos. lost in the middle. Seriously, Danos is talking about coffee right now. I almost made some. And then I decided not to, and I'm dying. I am jonesing for a cuppa. Listen. Has so anyone ever got lost in a meadow? I guess if it's a really huge meadow, and you're in the middle of it, maybe. You posted <laughs> a photo of you playing Lost Skies. Is that what the game's called? No, not What's at it all. called? <laughs> Under Falling Skies. Why did I say Lost Skies? <laughs> I'm a little out of it. Um, and I saw your picture on the Dice Tower, and I was upstairs, and I didn't know you were playing it down here. And all of a sudden you posted it, and I checked Facebook, and I saw you, and like my heart pitter pattered. I was like, oh my gosh, I know him. Like it was this really weird little moment of like, hmm. wait, what? Because usually when we post stuff, I'm with you. That's true. And then I got a little twinge of sadness because oh. I wasn't playing a game with you. You didn't want to. I you didn't want to play anything with me. Yeah, I did. I'm joking. Okay, let's, all right, Meadow. Let's do this. Um, so, Meadow is a fantastic game. It's amazing. Okay? That's Love all you it. need to know. It's shot up to my top 10. Go. There is um, this main, or this main, this is the campfire board here, and we'll get into all this here in a second. But there are hey, um, two of these double sided. So, there's a single um, two player, three, and four player um, modes, basically. And the only thing that's different is how many of these objectives. There are, and they're not even objectives, I guess they're like um, goals. And um, there's all these different symbols that you'll come across in this array of cards. And if you visit the campfire and you have the two adjacent symbols, like here is a paw print and some berries, you get to put your lowest scoring marker there and score some points. You have a two, three, and four scoring marker, and you have to put it lowest to highest. And essentially, on each of the boards, um, there's always going to be one person that can't potentially get all three of their tokens out. So there's two, three. Chrissy, we totally will. She said, "Get make sure you get cute close-ups. Close-ups oh, of the we cute cards. Will. Chrissy Stern. Every time a wild animal comes out, Chrissy will show you. <laughs> um, this is the main board. Um, if you ever played Quadropolis, it does have a similar um, mechanic to how that is done. So you have these beautiful little notch. Beautiful little butterfly. Um, things here. That and cool. in a uh, two... A solo two and three player game, you play with all of them. In a four player game, you don't have this little question mark. This one basically can do any one of the other four things. So these are dual purpose. So if you go to the main board, which is the main board you saw with all the cards, um, that is what you get here. And I'll show you how that works in a second. If you visit the campfire, you put the square notch part into the campfire, and then you get a special ability. And we'll get to that in a second as well. That's not the one I want. No, it ain't. There, there it is. Is that focus? Yeah. Oh, babe, you want to focus. I can't tell. I can't so you tell. can take any one of your numbers that you want and put it in any of these 12 notches around the board. And Hi, then you Lori count Menard. from there how many spaces from there. Laura's here. Hello. <laughs> is the game hard to find right now? <laughs> Um, yeah, it is a little hard to find. I got it at our friendly local game store. There's a couple of places online that I saw it. Amazon has a pre-order that you can get it in a couple of weeks. Okay. Um, Hi, Robert. But yeah. All right, keep going. So. Um, so you put this in any notch you want, and then you count that many spaces, and that's the card you grab. So there you go, right there. So say <laughs> I wanted this card. I could either put a two right here. I could put a three right here. Or I could put the three right there. So I have all sorts of different options. Now, since these all have special abilities, you may want to keep certain ones for their special abilities later in mm -hmm. the round. Um, a round goes is six rounds in a two-player game. Or a one through three-player game is six rounds. I don't know for one for sure. Two and three for sure is six rounds. Oh, and four-player is eight rounds. Chris is on a wait list for this one. That's crazy. I guess I didn't realize. Uh, yeah, that's why I kind of snatched it up. Mm, good choice. Baby. Anyway, so you might want to keep them for their special ability at the bottom, so depending on which ones you put out there, 
um, you might want to hold certain ones back. As these go along, these will get fuller and fuller, and at some point, you won't be able to get a card. So if you got a situation like this, this card is never going to be able to be taken this round because you can't grab it from any direction. Okay, so especially in a four player game, this board gets super tight, which is um, quite lovely. Uh, I like the tightness at totally. four. Totally. Right? Totally. So as you grab the cards, you put them into your hand. So you'll start off with five cards in your hand, and we'll get to that in a second. And then you can play one card. So if you go here, you take one card, and you can play one card if you want. You really should be playing cards as many times as you can because it's like almost always good. Sometimes it's worth holding stuff back just in case because you need different symbols, etc. So as you're acquiring cards, the top left symbol of these cards. Not on Gabe Nerds either. Mm, that's crazy. So you can see every card in oh, here is it's unique. An ent. It's and an I have ent. the uh, yeah, we have the fantasy pack. I love so it. there's an ant and there's a couple other like jackrabbits and oh. stuff like that with like ant antlers or whatever. Love it. Um, and there's like Christmas packs and all sorts yes. of stuff in here. <laughs> so the top left is your um, symbol that's currently visible in the game. The other important thing are these bottom um, squares. So many of these will have a bottom square, and those are your ground level. All right. And there's five different ground levels. There's wetlands, there's rocks, there's sands, there's grasslands, mm -hmm. and litterfall, which is like leaves. Yeah, okay? Kane, kind of like Targi too, a little bit. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Bit the grid yep. style For thing. Sure. Yeah. For sure. Uh, you need to have grounds as your base. Now, you can have up to a, mm, ten. 10 cards in you your will. base, okay? Ten now, ten as person. you're um, acquiring cards and you're putting cards down, they'll have requirements on them. So let's see if I can grab... Here we go. I can grab this one. I can grab this one. So here's a couple of cards. Say I have these in my hand. These are the requirements. This one here requires a grassland and a desert. This one requires a grub and a grassland. And now you have to have those somewhere in your tableau. So anywhere amongst all of your cards that are visible. Your ground symbols are always visible. And these um, icons in the top left will get covered as you put cards down. So remember, it's only visible symbols. So in this case, this tree requires a sands, which I do not have. So I currently would not be able to play that even though I have a grassland. But this beautiful butterfly. You'll hear that a lot tonight. This requires a grub and a, um, and a grass. Grassland. Okay. Hi, Games of Fire. So in this instance, say I have two different grassland symbols and a grub. I have to have them at least somewhere in my tableau, which I do. I have a grub and a grassland. I can then put that on any card that has at least one of those symbols. So in this case, I could put it here or I could put it here. All right, so I'll show you that in the close-up too. So I can put that here because it matches at least one, or I can put it here because it matches at least one one symbol and now it's there okay ground has to go on the bottom so they can never go above now going further along um, i can get other cards that can potentially cover that one i don't have any ex specific examples here but say this <laughs> one matches here then you can um, cover cards up and you keep kind of covering cards as you go along this game is so, so going vertical is um a great way of getting points because the ground level's never given you any points, only the ones that kind of go above the ground level. Brad Brewster says, I'm liking this. Um, Brad, we thought that the thematicness, thematicishness Thematic thematicness? of the eco system right? oh, this is a pure... mechanic I don't remember exactly is what awesome. These were, and if you think about it, there was one thing where we're like, why would the bird, what was it? Why would the bird die or something like that? Oh, from the berries. Yeah, and it's because they're poisonous berries. So it's they don't necessarily every, no, die. No, but it all these... has. They work off each other as it, like in nature. It's, it's an ecosystem, same kind. Yeah. right? So it's kind of so representing clever. like what's there. So, you know, for a tree to survive, it needs to be on a certain area, right? For a grubs, obviously, turn into butterflies, right. and then butterflies can be a food source for something else. So like, they all have to be in so there neat. to be out. So it really works. 
super well thematically. It's, it's really Eagle fantastic Warriors. how they do it. It's organic. This game is organic. Um, there's also some roads here. So we all start with one road. We all start with one road. And you can get more roads with your special abilities, which I'll get to at the very end here. And uh, you can acquire cards that go on there. They're called landscape cards. So this requires a road. Sometimes it requires a road and a tree or something. So same kind of um, ruling as the rest of the cards. Then you flip that over just to show <laughs> that it's been used. You should pop And then the from there, you can good question. get other cards to cover those. So this one is now a landscape. And this is representing like the things and trinkets and stuff that you find along your journeys. And so this one requires a landscape, which we had, and then a tree. Now, I don't have a tree currently, but if I had a tree, I would be able to place that. Uh, if you've been noticing here, all of these leaves have a point number on them. That is the point value of the card. So what did I think of right away? With all these leaves on all them. All these leaves on them. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't say that. Ah. Right? Ah. So the other thing you could do is then spend these for their special abilities. So there are four special abilities. So on the four, if you go, so I should show this first, I guess. You can use these by going to the um, campfire. Now in a two player game, there's three notches open. So if they're full, obviously you can't go there. Um, you could also go here, which is really never a great option, but it is an option. It the other but day. that's not a bad option either. In a four either. player game, and I needed game, to get a card out that was. Yeah. Because this, you can just play solid. one card. So it's always better to go to the main board because you draw one and play one. This one <laughs> is just kind of like a consolation. Loopy's right, so. just buy it. All right. She's going to love it. If you go to the campfire here, not only can you do your special ability, that's how you claim these different um, goals. Mm -hmm. So remember, if you get the. Um, matching pair between the two, then you can put out your token. All right, you can put up to one token per time you go there. This is two player? Yep. Mm, okay. So going back to this, mm. so the special ability of the four is you can play two cards out of your hand versus Lock. the normal one. Um, the three here is you can scry three cards. So basically you can take three cards from any deck, look at them and draw one. So that's just a good way of like, if there's something out there that you don't want, or you, you know, that there's something that you have available that you don't want. That's a way of getting cards. The two here, you'll grab two more of these road tiles. John, that's kind of what Randy does too. And, and he, he also does not get in trouble. What? Um, and <laughs> go ahead. <clears throat> wow, my throat got really dry from talking. Um, you get two more road tiles, and you need these tiles to get more landscapes and things like that. So it's just like more places you can play cards. And then this one is take any one card from the array um, anywhere. So that's just another way. If you can't get to a certain card, you can use that to grab that card. All right? Um, that's basically it. So these cards get populated with the S deck. These are the West deck, and these are the East deck. East deck always has ground symbols. Um, the West Tech usually has your landscape. The S is kind of a bunch of everything. And then halfway through the game, when we get in a two-player game, once we get to the fourth round, everything gets wiped, and then the North Deck comes out. This is basically another way of getting, like, a ton of points. Okay. because um, Or more points, because these come out, and they're, like, a lot of threes and fours. So it's a, a lot of big point scorers in the North Deck. There's also this super handy little um, sheet here that's on the back that kind of tells you the general displacement or disbursement, yeah, I should say, really handy, of actually. the different symbols. So if, especially if you're like scrying for a, a certain card and you go, man, I really need a butterfly. Well, I would want to try to go into the north deck to get that. Ooh. Also, super it came handy with a well. little tighter view. It came with a little um, booklet that has all of the like animals and insects in it. This is just oh, purely yeah. for your knowledge if you want to know about your cards. I don't really care, but it is really, really cool. I thought it was very cool that they this include this. card index. My son loved it, got it, ripped it. We put it back together. Hmm. But isn't that kind of cool? It gives yeah. information about all so of the animals. So every single card in... Plants maybe too? 
every every Look, card, wow. every card in the game, it tells you that's above and beyond. Like C thirty one is a dune, so and then it says most dunes are characterized by the asymmetry of the slopes. <laughs> Moving dunes are created when sand slides, and the tops of the dunes move with the wind. So does it, it just kind of gives you Imperium in there. It doesn't. It's like get your spices here. <laughs> So it um, it gives you like a little background of every single bird, insect, etc. on here, and it even has like a little like log, so you can like mark the date and time or place that you saw them. That's just cool. All right, let's play with angle. So pretty, kind of a neat little. All right, go first. Extra add on. In the beginning, God created the heavens. No, you pick one of these things, one of these rows of cards, and add a north card into your hand, and then you start the game with the five cards. That's so correct. you do it first. Since I'm the start player, you go first. Dune and Spice may flow. Oh, dang it. Okay. <laughs> Oy. Um, tree, bird, landscape, grub. Tree, bird, I have landscape. a grub. I have a grub. Um, do any of those work off each other? Not really. Mm, not really. This one's got says. two things and two things, though. Yeah, that's, that's a good roll. That's pretty great. Yeah. So I'm taking this one because this landscape, it's not landscape, what is this? Ground tile. Ground, yeah. It's got two types of ground. Two. And then this card here is tree and berries. So that's pretty, um, that's pretty great to have two symbols on the tag. And then could you hand me a north card, please? Ellen beat me to the dune reference. I was going to ask about the sandworms. I knew half of you at least were thinking of dune stuff. So there you go. Oh, wow. All this right. Early. Mm, tree. Interesting. Hmm. This game Paw is gorgeous. And you know what? I have a feeling it's going to be one of those games where there's silence all of a sudden. Because it's pretty right? thinky. Yeah, definitely. It's pretty thinky. Um, what should I take? <laughs> there's nothing particularly fantastic here for me, to be honest. Sorry about that, man. I think about taking this set here, though. This one or that one? Ah, uh, choices, choices, choices. Gotta make a choice, baby. Gotta make a choice. Do I want this one or this one? Um, follow your heart. I'm gonna take. I think. I'm gonna take this one. So I get those four in a North Cod as well. And then these all refill. Oof. There's a lot of going through cards in this game. They're constantly, constantly, constantly coming out. Hi, time roller. What's going on? We're playing right. Meadow, and it's gorgeous. And then um, your starting card here can be either a beetle with a litter fall, or it can be a grub with a grassland. So depending on which kind of cards you picked up at the beginning, that definitely might determine what card uh, you prefer to have. So I'm going to start with the beetle. I'm starting with a grub. All right. All right, so cards okay. chosen. My turn. Here we go. Here we go. That's a Ooh, lot of I'm rocks. nervous. Even the winter cards are I so know, they're gorgeous. Uh, Valerie, it's it definitely seems like there's more to it. There's a lot of thinkiness as there you're is. playing the cards. Mm -hmm. um, and I obviously went on talking about it for a little bit, but yes, you did. If you're playing it, it's. If somebody's teaching you especially, it is super easy to pick up. But, I mean, I, it obviously is, it's and, not um, the easiest. I think it starts kind of slow-ish, and then there's some ramping that happens at the, at the back of the game. Um, um, I read Dune about two weeks ago. My memory of the book was not terribly accurate, either due to age or due to the Lynch movie. Good grief. I really want to see them. Oh, you guys, speaking of things to yeah, watch, I'm gonna take has anyone seen the first picture yet for the new Lord of the Rings show coming out? Oh. <gasps> It blew my mind. I was like, Jackson, come here. I showed all my boys, and they're so excited. All right, so I grabbed one card. Again, I used my number one to grab the one card in front of me. I could have also used my four or my two to grab that same card. If I use that one. And I get to play any one card from my hand. So I have six cards in my hand now because I started with five. And what do I want to play? I want to play this one. Um, Judy said something that's the pretty one I important just up. here. She says, I think I will sleep better if I have this game in our collection. Um, you might sleep better. <laughs> <laughs> if it's you really buy good. it and then buy sleeping pills that night, yes, you're going to sleep better. <laughs> uh, yes, it's coming out <sighs> September the 2nd of 2022, so a year and one month from today. So, yeah, so it is a little exciting. while. Exciting. So exciting. <sighs> Winter may be uh, pretty, but yeah, it's a little it's, warmer. Yeah. It's, it obviously was a rendering, Steven, so I mean, there's always that. But 
Oh, it's going to be amazing. Um, after we take a couple of quick turns here, we will uh, give instructions on how to win Yes, Moon we Rakers. will. Is it my turn? Yeah. Excellent. Um, wow. Oh, you guys. Ba -ba but it's not supposed to be. Yeah, I, I... No, it won't be cartoonish, I don't think. I mean... No. That's CG... I mean, it was CGI... But I, mean, it I would. To be to it seemed like it was definitely an artistic kind of take on it, yeah. just to kind of catch your attention, from what I can tell. It seemed like something that. But it looked like it's Valinor, from what I can it tell. It is Valinor. I read it. Oh, okay, because it has the two the two trees. Did you know about that without reading the article? I have read. Oh, <gasps> that's so impressive! I, Thank you. I read. That is so impressive. Yeah, so it looks like it to is be from Valinor. Valinor so. Yeah, I'm soups stoked. Soup stoked. All right. I will get a tree. Uh, this game is one of those up my alley, as you know. Just about every card. Every time, look at this thing sticking to my arm. As they pick up all but one North card, so I would it's most likely I have, have lotion on my each tat. person's hand as they pick. Um, yeah, I guess you could. It's your turn, babe. Oh, and you have to refill the thing. Mm. Oh, that's right. You don't do that kind of you, thing. He said he would memorize each person's hand as they pick. Oh. <sighs> I couldn't do that if I tried. Alright, what's It's not in my um, abilities. What's new? I'd like to play the little rings. What does that mean, Jimmy? All I don't right. know what that means. We're going to pick up this tree card right here. What is Jimmy, you guys? Am I saying it totally wrong? Jimmy? Alright. I don't know what that um, is. But I'm very excited for it. As you well know, because I keep talking about it. I don't have a grasslands yet. That was probably not the pick thing to pick. Oh well. Huh. I probably shouldn't have picked. Oh, that. I just picked and played that right away, didn't I? Dang, I didn't even know I did that. Uh, I done did that. You know what? Can I take that? So I'm gonna take you. that back. Yeah, sure. Well, no, because that's we already know. What, oh. oh, Journey's in Middle Earth. Oh my gosh. Okay, I was that's like, true. somebody please I'll tell take me. It. I'll take it. Randy reads books and knows things. <laughs> Lori, Randy knows. At least this much about every right, topic. So I am going to play my birdie. In the world. So it requires a beetle. I have a beetle. Ask and him a weird question. I beetle. promise you he'll know a little bit about oh, it. That's Actually, we're going to do that challenge. Somebody think of a weird question Your to ask turn. Randy about anything. Oh, boy. And let's see if he knows. Gosh. <laughs> Jimmy is my new favorite. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was Jimmy. Is Hi, Jimmy? beetle paper cut. What did you say? About Journeys you? in Middle Earth. They were like, ac oh. what's it called? acronym -ing it. Oh, sure. Abbreviating? Yeah. I don't know. Acronym. Did I, did I get that word right? Acrostic. Acrostic? Is that right? I don't know what you're trying to get to. I don't. I have no idea. Quite honestly. Um. Okay. So I need that out. I need. This game reminds me of like chai for some reason. Um. Quite different from quite chai. Quite different, as far but as same. Relaxing. It's got the same comforting, relaxing. Comforting. Vibe. That's a great word, babe. That's great. Thanks. I need to get out a bird. I did a stupid thing. I'm a stupid person. Are there any birds out there? Um, I have a bird. Yeah, there's a bird right here. It needs a beetle and a tree. Sweet. You have a tree. Are there any beetles? A... There is there is a beetle as well. A beetle and a bird. Which one are you going to want the most? I don't know. I think that I shall never see a thing as lovely as a tree. I have all sorts of stuff I want to do, but there's only so much that I can do. Okay, first question on the stump, on the stump Randy special. How many rule books have you read so far? Not the kind of question I meant. But how many questions have, or how many how many rule books, books have, have I read, read so far? Well, I've read every one of games that we have owned and played. So, uh, oh, fatal. That's, at, a, at that's least, a great question. At least three hundred. <laughs> oh my gosh. At least 300? At least oh 300. Oh my gosh. Acronym works. I think that was right. Randy, the all-knowing. Is it Berenstein Bears or Berenstein Bears? Um, I have I a ton of Berenstein Bears. He Bear loves those books. books. That's a great question. I would have to say it's S-T-E-I-N. Berenstein Bears books. S-T-E-I-N, I would think. Is that your final answer? I guess. Yeah, you're right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, like, what are the chances of him, like, knowing that book and then he loves them? He bought, like, our boys, like, a ton of them, a whole stack of them a few years ago. <laughs> Question. How many city employees <laughs> did it take to change my daughter's bone tire this week? 
Okay, so oh, they're no. they're city employees. It is your turn, by the way. So they would have been in a group of a minimum of three, I would say. So I would say it took four. Is that'd that the my, answer? That'd be my guess. Four. This is so great. Because there's, there's always at least three people <laughs> together, it seems. <laughs> oh, All right, so is good. it my turn? Yep, it is. It I went. You did? Oh. You didn't play another card? Oh, no, I didn't. I forgot. Dang, nabbit. Maybe forget to do that. Um. <laughs> Plus a supersizer. Somebody, what is the velocity of a swallow? Uh, <laughs> is it laden or not laden? <laughs> <laughs> Blue. You know, yellow. <laughs> All right, your turn. Uh, that's good. That's good. That's good. All right. It's weird, though. Randy does know, like, the weirdest facts about things. I'm like, how do you even know that? You, you are correct. Know. I can't believe you got it. I told yes. you. I, this is the person I game with. How do I even stand a chance? Oh, you didn't put a card up. Oh, my gosh. Fist of Zuck says, is that is that how you say that name? That's awesome. What are those city employees' names? <laughs> you should try and guess. And oh, just, geez. just random guessing. Good grief. I don't know. Phil. <laughs> Phil. There's always a Phil at the office. Phil, Danny, and Sarah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's carrying one pound ask. coconut. <laughs> I would say the airspeed, well, okay, so the actual airspeed velocity of a swallow is what? It's got to be like. I'm telling you. Obviously, you wouldn't be able to hold a coconut, but like just to swallow, I would have to say. Uh, what's the airspeed of a swallow? It probably can get up to like 12 miles per hour, I would say. I don't know. Okay, let's look it up. <laughs> it's your turn. What is the airspeed velocity of a swallow? Sure. <laughs> what is the airspeed velocity of a swallow? Right, me again, huh? An, un right. an unlanded swallow. What did you say? What did you say? I need a toadstool. Kind of want. So they're asking yeah. about velo airspeed velocity. So yeah. what? How many? What did you say it was? I said they could probably get up to like twelve miles per hour. No, you're wrong. What is it? Twenty. Right? Is that right? Twenty-four miles per hour. Oh, 24 miles per hour. Oh, so all double right. double what you said. But right. hey, that's I'm that's sorry. still that's all I right. I failed you. You you did a little bit. <laughs> Serious question for anyone. I need that curd. All right. Um, I want to get this tree. When do you pick an eggplant? I have them in the garden, just not sure when they are ripe. Oh, that's man. a great question. He says that's for anybody. Randy, how many vertebrae are there in a giraffe's neck? <laughs> the same as a human's, which is what thirteen. Serious? Do you freaking know this for real? It's just really big. I'm gonna punch you in a second. Look at that. I'm seriously gonna punch you. <laughs> how many? Yeah. How many vertebrae in a giraffe neck? This is ridiculous. Thirteen? Seven? Seven. Oh, but seven. they do have. I knew it was just a, like humans. I knew it was the same as humans. I told I you he much. knows weird crap, guys. I don't know why. Good day, <laughs> all. Hello, bold and play. Greetings from Oz. Oh, that's awesome. But you did say that I would know at least something. That's what it. I said. I, I didn't say he knew everything. So I'll count that as a win. For yeah, I do too. He, Randy knows the weirdest things right. I about. Win. I don't understand right, him. Like, take one do more you just turn. Read articles take all day? one more turn, then we'll give we'll give out some okay give some, some instructions. Instruction. I truly don't know why how you do that. It's just it just freaks me out. I don't know. I, I'm filled with useless information. <laughs> but for me to retain, like, important information, it's difficult. Ellen, you missed my city employee explanation. Oh, what happened? Oh. What did we miss? Here, you find it while I play my card. Okay. Um, I need a beetle, and I have a tree. Uh, one was in the car, two came to help, and one happened to be driving by and stopped. <laughs> Oh my gosh, yes. that's hilarious. Is that that's not what you said, is no, it? No, oh, no. I was I like, said they what? always happen to be like together. Oh my yeah. gosh. That's so funny. to play a card, any card. Um, um shoot. If I do that, it'll cover my tree. If you guys went on double dare in like 95, you'd win. That's right. Yeah, totally. Leon, we have just picked them in the Did you see the new expansion for architects? Yes, it looks great. I love architects. Okay, I'm doing this. I always remember the facts not worth knowing as one of my his, uh, high school history teachers called them. <laughs> <laughs> Mind blown, yes. It's I'm serious. If you think of any questions, uh, you're just John ask Greer, him. did I read encyclopedias as a kid? Did you? I did. 
<laughs> Here's the thing. So did I. And I know nothing. So I remember had, the pictures. We had the complete um, had world CDs. book. Um, one. The big expensive, like, three, $400 set of color encyclopedias. And I used to look at those constantly. We had that, those two um, a little Part bit of the reason, like. because we lived pretty far away. I only had, like, two friends as a kid anyway. And then we lived really far away from them. So I spent a lot of time alone. But Randy, <laughs> I feel like even if you did have a lot of friends, you would still be reading encyclopedias because that's the kind of guy you are. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that. it's cute. I love it. It's so good. All right. Is everybody yeah. ready for some yeah, instructions? Yeah, let's give us some instructions. Instructiones. Right. So this is Moonrakers. We've talked Ow. about it. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's all good. There we go. <sighs> Yeah, circa 80s and 90s, exactly. <laughs> and they were definitely 80s, because I think we had them the entire time I was a kid, I believe. Ooh, Randy, why are hamburgers called hamburgers when they are made of beef? Um, Isn't it the guy's name? That's McDonald's. No, that was a sandwich for sure, but... um, You, you continue to do this, and I'm going to look that I up. I don't know. I would have guessed it, would, it was named after the guy who like made them, but I do not know. Mm. I do not know. And you guys got some good random questions. They're See, so I'm not good. I'm not as smart as you think I am. Oh, it comes from the okay, according Hamburg, to Hamburg, Germany. The name oh, Ham excellent. Yeah, Hamburg comes from the seaport town of Hamburg. That's excellent. really cool. All right, cool. I will retain that information. Thank you, Chadley. <laughs> he totally will. <laughs> Why use a rake on the moon when we could just use a leaf roller? <laughs> Love it. Because power <laughs> is limited up in space. It is limited. So I mean, you, would, you spend all that energy lift that <laughs> carrying a leaf blower into space to only be able to use it for a certain amount of time. Right. Although I guess you could Obviously. get solar chargers for it. So maybe that blows that out of the way. Anyway. Anyways, okay, what do people do? What did do you show do? off the new tent without the bandage? You did. You I did. show it off again? Hey, Mitch, by the way. Mitch Brain. There it is. Here it is. Um, it is not super subtle. It's really interesting because my arms are hanging. Like Britannica. Yeah, you we had see world book, Joey. Yeah, world book. A bizarre. lot of plain skin. Yeah. But then that's when I'm true. just standing with my arm <laughs> hanging down, you can see it wrapping from behind, which is so cool. And then the more I twist my arm, the more crazy it is on the inside, and I I absolutely adore it. So I am quite happy. Nathan quite says happy. Davis, I lost to the Paladins. Easy AI with 23 points. That's too bad. <laughs> uh, my shirt says surely. Not everybody was kung fu fighting. Birthday present from my mother. <laughs> anyway, Very moon nice present. So I'm going to put this in the chat. I don't want to wear it. I probably um, will. So you can email us um, this hashtag that I'm about to put into the chat. So if you put this hashtag, hashtag <laughs> in the subject of the email, um, and then we'll, we, we will use that to um yeah cool we will use that to sort out the entries and then we'll throw it into a random number gen generator through random.org and then uh the winner if you're present um uh, will get <clears throat> the game the game and right? um a little quick repeat just it put your name in the in the body of the email if you could it's not yeah. completely necessary to win because we will email you back right um, to get details. So you don't have to worry about putting any uh, personal information that you don't want to in the original email. Uh, once we select one and you win, then uh, we'll obviously need your name and address and things so we know where to send it. Uh, but if you don't want to give that information out right away for whatever reason, um, that is not necessary. Um, yep. But if you could put your name and maybe even your um, current on it. your current name that you're yeah. using on whatever you're watching, so YouTube or Twitch handle, uh, just so we can call you out by that if you prefer. There's a little so dust here, that's been sitting here for a long time. Here is the hashtag. Um, so there you go there. Moon so put that hashtag, giveaway. hashtag Moonrakers giveaway into the subject of your email and you can email that to us at this. That's very good, babe. Um, somebody who was that was making too busy making dad jokes they didn't hear the contest stuff. So we you can are email it game to away here. Today. So we board game together at gmail.com. So again, that is hashtag Moonrakers giveaway. That is in the chat there. Uh, put that in your subject line and then email that to we board game together at gmail.com. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. uh, we'll give everybody what 20 minutes? Yeah, 20 minutes. 20 minutes from start. Once you start a timer on your phone. I was gonna tell her to do it, but okay. I well, if do. we ask Alice to do it, then it might activate that's everybody's. That's true, that's true. <laughs> Uh, so, however many entries we have, that's the uh, random numbers that we will we'll sign basically everybody. 20 minutes on the clock, baby. 
We'll say, um, email us. assign everybody a random number. We'll put it into random.org, which they tell me is about as random as a number generator as you can get. So that's what we're going to do. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, bring those in. Bring them in. Bring them in. Yep. And then you guys, uh, just a quick little rundown again. This is a uh, negotiation um, part, like ship built. Oh, it's not ship building. What is it? I can't even think of the words. Isn't that deck building? Uh, is it? Paper yes, cut. It is. You do building, not need to put anything in the body of the email. Yeah, you don't have um, to. We will email you back. Um, it is Moonraker's giveaway. Um, give away. Give away. Did I give put, away. Give oh, away. did you? Oh, jeez. Oh, for crap's sake. What a dummy. You I will make Randy? sure. <laughs> I will give make away. sure. It should be giveaway. I know some people have been putting both. That's fine. I will make sure. Because uh, I see all the emails coming in, so I will make sure. Oh wow! Um, Everybody's sending in emails right away. This is so cute. I will make sure to it. search both of those. So do not worry. Don't worry about um, entering it twice. Uh, whichever one you happen to do. Um, I knew I should have copied and pasted that from my notes, yeah. but you know, go figure. So yeah, giveaway or giveaway is so perfectly fine. We will make sure that all of your entries are entered. If you happen to, can they only email us one time? Yes, yeah, Ellen. Yes. Well, I didn't know if they were going to email with give away and then give away. Well, if they if you do both for some reason because you you didn't hear me say only do one of the two, um, I will sort through them and only um, add their like and only add yeah. one of the two. Okay. All right. That's so cool. Thanks, you guys. All right, yep. So I in love about twenty names. ish minutes, we will um, <laughs> give her away. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> give way. Oh, jeez. I knew I should have. too much to say. I was going to copy it from the stupid <laughs> friggin' notes section of my of my little thing here, and I didn't, and then go figure. You know, Randy, it's just, it's really <laughs> embarrassing. Give her away. Well, this is our first, gi <laughs> is our first give her away. So. Give her away for the winner. <laughs> yes, good luck, everyone. Uh, um, that's hilarious. Yes. All right. So, yeah, in about 20 minutes or so, when that uh, timer oh. goes off, we will choose. Yeah, Leon, those are my cards. My cards. It's all good though. Don't feel don't feel stupid. You're not right. stupid. Saw so my QML address verification for the Grand Oscar. Ooh, exciting! Oh, excellent. I hear great things about that game. Have I played that? That's what I get from copying and pasting for chat. Like I said, Stephen, it was meant to be put in there, so it would be just yeah. as easy to do that. But I have seen your email. You are fine. Don't worry about <laughs> it. <laughs> I know. I know. Gosh, I'm so stupid. Hilarious. Valerie forgives me. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully other people do as well. <laughs> first time giveaway. <laughs> Shut up, panic. <laughs> first time giveaway. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love that panic's there to catch that and be like, oh, twist grief. the knife a little bit. Good grief. <laughs> All right. Forgive Whose us. turn is it? My turn or yours? Mine. Ah, uh, your turn. <laughs> All right. So I can now play this card, which is good. <laughs> yes, Grand Austrian need... Hotel. Have I played that? That is not out yet. No, the that game, though. I'm never going to oh. be able to get. I'm not talking to you, girl. Why are you talking to me? I ain't and talking to you. Us. I don't like how bright this is. I feel, like, washed oh, out. Stop. No, I look stop pasty. It. I look gross. Oh. All right. I'm pasty white. Oh, my gosh. I, I have grass talking grass about this place. Oh, that's so cool. Board them play. There ain't no grasslands to be Got had. tracking for, ooh, Glenmore to Highland Games earlier today. Oh, speaking of Highland Games. Um... The city of Wokisha puts on a I Highland really Game one, event change. at our local expo center. And they have like sheep herding competitions and, um, right. what's it We're called? We're going Caliber? for the flying squirrel. What's that thing called when you toss the big tree? Cab caber. Caber. Caper? Caber. Caber toss. Um, you can look up your genealogy right. there. They have like a whole booth about that. It's just so All right, lovely. so I'm gonna put down games. my tree, which takes two litter falls, my ant. So I'm playing an ant. Oh, <laughs> I want that. And I'm gonna put that, so it takes two litter falls. So let me go back to the screen here. It takes two litter falls, and I have two, so I can either put it on this tree, or I can put it over my bird, because it has Ooh. a litter fall at the bottom. Give way. Gator give said way. give way with like whey protein. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Dominic. Uh, yep, over overhead cam. Thank you. Oh, hi, Dominic. Um, Randy and the caber toss. No, but my mom hosts a like thing for St. Patty's Day every year and she does cabbage tossing and caber tossing and then we hit the cabbage with a baseball bat. I have done like 
I think what they call weird. a junior caber toss. Did you really? Yeah, it's pretty, it's not as big as the pros, but it's pretty big. And it's super friggin' heavy. Guys, Randy actually did junior caber toss. I'm telling not you. Not like as a comp, like a, it was like a. crazy stuff. There was a thing at camp and everybody had a host what? like a, a, a game Yeah, cabbage like tossing. So our group did uh, caber <laughs> toss. So we made these big, actually from, um. We made them from um, telephone poles because one of the people in our group is a lineman for We Energies. So he had like, you know, he has access to like older, like ones that they cut out, like um, telephone poles. And obviously the top of them is a lot skinnier than the bottom. Oh, Randy. But yeah. You and your weird facts and stuff. I love it. Soup's cute. Thanks. So. Um, is a cabbage toss a salad? <laughs> Tossing the salad. <laughs> cabbage toss. Yeah, is a salad we. My mom raised us doing like all the holidays. We make Valentine's boxes for Valentine's Day, and we we celebrate everything. We, that's just kind of what we did as kids, and it was good times. <laughs> Leon says, when I was a kid. They had a sheep herding thing at the fair. One of the dogs got frustrated and ripped one of the sheep's legs off. Oh, no! <laughs> the sheep just wouldn't go where the duck wanted. Oh my gosh, wow. it ripped it off? <gasps> <gasps> so get it a caber toss merit oh badge. Um, so we have a... Uh, so I was part of Boy Scouts like when I was younger. And then um, a group called um, Royal Rangers, which is through the um, First Assembly Church. But basically, like... When you get to the highest level of that, it's equivalent to Eagle Scout, and I did all that stuff. But then um, each year up at one of the main um, Wisconsin Northern Michigan camps, the main one for the district, um, mm. they they have like different – every year they have like a different thing. And our group is one of the biggest in the um, state, so we always have like this big, huge thing. Usually our stuff was really good because we just had a lot of people – to help out with all that and, and whatnot. I think I'm going to scry for the first time. Uh, Randy, the all-knowing. <laughs> Jeez. Which will toss farther? I, be, I think that would be further, right? Which would charge further? further, I think. Yeah. A lettuce or a fine cabbage? Um, I would say a cabbage. <laughs> they hear, they're denser. Oh, this is the That's first scry say. that was unsuccessful for me. Farther or further? <laughs> Fatal further could have said farther or further. I think it's further, I believe. Further. Mutton for dinner. I don't know. Maybe Mutton's, I don't a know. Good. Mutton's pretty good. Or oh, sheep. That makes it super hits. sad. That is super sad. That is really terrible. Right. Did I That's grab that? That's super terrible. I didn't. Guys, our state fair is coming up, and we plan on going, and one of my favorite things to get is a turkey leg. The mutton just reminded me of that, which I know is not the same thing. But I always go buy this huge turkey leg, and I sit there and eat it like a beast, and I rip hmm. it up and dip it in barbecue sauce, and then I toss the bone when I'm done. I'm gonna and take it's this so one. So fun! I can't wait. Can't wait. All right, and then I'm gonna turkey play leg. this. So I have two trees. So I'm gonna play my flying squirrel. Love it. I believe I'm gonna put my flying thing. squirrel on <laughs> this right there. Yeah, cabbage is super solid. I mean, it is. It's a denser cabbage leaf. It's like. Yeah, cabbage is, is definitely denser. I would say that that would go sturdier. Farther, my... Oh boy, uh, first or fourth thing. <laughs> what day is Harry Potter's birthday? Is our state fair a great Ooh. state fair? Yeah, fun. Okay. Nathan, which which state do you live in, Nathan? Is our state fair a great state fair? Are you quoting a song, Nathan? I feel like that's a song. I would like to know yeah, what fair, state you're like. in, and then I can then I'll try to make a better guess. I'm thinking what day is Harry me. Potter's birthday? Yeah, I feel like we both should know this. Oh yeah, he's he said it's my birthday. I don't know what it's it's before school starts, right? So I don't know March or not March. It'd be like March. June or something. Oh, July thirty first. Oh, I was gonna say uh. June. I was gonna say June <laughs> sometime. So I was dang wrong. it! I wish I knew that. Uh, funnel cakes are fantastic. It's in the summer. It's in the yeah. summer. Dang. Man, you guys are good. See, I'm good dumb. questions. I'm dumb. No, See, it's just you're, you've now revealed to everybody how stupid I am. Thanks. <laughs> He's Alan. actually dumb, guys. Sorry. Um. Okay. Can I do something? Birthday now? or bur birthday? <laughs> birthday. I'm in Texas. Our state fair is trash. <laughs> oh. I would have said that Texas would not have been the greatest state fair. Why is that? Why don't you think Texas would be great? I just think it'd be kind of dull. Really? Yeah. Why? Okay, oh. I'm going to play this. And play it right away. Pick it up, play it. Boom! I love Texas, though. I'm a big fan of Texas. Texas is great. 
I got one of those massive turkey legs from the gar bu bush, bush bush. I almost said bruche. What the heck? Realized it was basically flavorless, so I was stuck walking around with this uh, <laughs> caveman sized turkey leg that I didn't want to eat, so I just tossed it. Yeah, you know, we've gotten some Oh, you didn't want to just not yeah. very good turkey legs. Yeah, there's one stand in particular that's that's fantastic. And then they give you these crappy forks though that bend. Yeah. I'm like, can we have some dignity? Can you give me a yeah. better fork? I mean, don't get me wrong. Why do you only I'll have four like cards put? I played one. Oh, I don't know. Did I ever get to play a card? Why do I have five cards played? How did that happen? <laughs> it's either why do I have four or why do you have five? <laughs> Shoot. I think we should oh, both no, no, have... Oh, no, no, no. Because I went here. Oh. And you can't play a card when you go to the campsite. You played three. Well, how do I have five played? The Texas State Fair used to be good. A few years we had baby tigers. But I only but that have was five back cards. In the 90s. Did I take an extra turn? Turkey legs aren't meant to be oh, eaten with forks. I knew someone was going to call me out for that. It's when you're trying to really dig in and get the meat out and you don't want to like get it up on your nose. Did I take an extra card? Yeah, somehow? Chrissy, you're right. No, I went here. I know, but like I have five cards played and I only went four. Oh, no, there's five. Gosh, there's five in a two player He's game. He's losing his ever living man. You went there, but you still have one more card. Oh, you have this one. Yeah. All right. Hey, we did it all correctly. <laughs> wow. Looky there, looky there. All right, so that is turn, so we can advance one space. Okay. We take all of our things back. Yep. Ellen is now the first player. I am. This game is a heck of a lot tighter yeah. at four players. Like, I feel like I'm just, like, shooting the breeze, having a picnic Ellen, right now. Track. Thank you, people that were actually paying attention. It's the only time you get to eat like you're in medieval times. <coughs> Chadley, I love it. And actually, Rain and I are thinking about taking the boys to the Bristol Fair, Renaissance Fair. And I really want to go. Yeah, I've only been one other time. Um, I'd been a couple of times, but we only went one time as a family. Yes. Right? We got the turkey leg. I walked around in a flowy floral dress with a crown <laughs> on. I don't think they, I don't know. I don't know if they did that in those times, but I did. It was great. It was well, they fun. were selling them there, so they had to have. Uh, there you go. I think it was a very maiden kind of like, you know, wreath with with. Yeah, ribbon. with the, you're right with the ribbons yeah. when they did like the the May. Harry Potter right just here. turned forty one. Holy cow! Wow. Yeah, Chrissy. Do you guys go to the Ren Fair? We we did the one time <laughs> with the boys. My boys are so into like. Just that kind of fantasy stuff. I mean, they're as nerdy as I am. They love Lord of the Rings. One of our, just, um, they're very whimsical. One of our um, people in our game group actually um, works at the Run Fair, or at least what? has in the past. Uh, Jason Conan? Jason Conan? Who are you, Jason Conan? Hello, Richard. That sounds funny. Oh, hey, Richard. How are you? Hey, where are you? Okay. I'm going to do something that's going to be awesome. I'm going to do something that's going to be awesome. The problem with this game, it's not a problem. Sometimes when you play a card and then you need to play this card, you play this on top of this, but then you accidentally cover your thing. It's very annoying. Interesting. And I don't want to do that. So interesting. We've got uh, quite Fun a few a entries game. here for the giveaway so Ooh, far. This is exciting, um, you it's guys. we got, what, a few minutes? Like 10 minutes left or something? Yeah. Once that Ellen timer goes off. Us. Here, scroll up, I missed something. Okay. Baby. Do you want this back? Sure. Okay, I have to have two trees, and if you I have to go this, somewhere I first. Do this. I know. Oh. Okay, um, sorry. I'm really distracted by chat this time. I know, it's great. I like that. It's also slower. It means they're super talky. So you just have to deal with it, chat. <laughs> it's your fault. It's your fault. If this is taking too long, it's your it's fault. It's your fault, man. Okay, where's all the good landscapes? Like, come in. Um, I took one. I guess I'm going to take this one because it's a three-pointer. It's got a bird. I'm working towards a bird. Okay, let's see. Um, Ellen talking with us is a good part of the reason we come. Randy spewing random knowledge is the other part. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> I love it. Oh, All let's right. see. I need some berries. Any relation to the barbarian? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Conan the Barbarian. Oh, I gosh. It's spelled differently. It's spelled K-O-N-E-N. Ellen is the crown princess of any lo locale that she might be present in. That is... I need some berries. All right, I'm going to grab some berries. I actually <laughs> wore the crown thing for our anniversary pictures that we got done a couple years ago. And I felt so cute. 
Okay, I'm going to grab um, this dirty play can. Richard, already on it. Already on it. I was just showing my boys oh. the first image that they have for that show oh, coming out, and we were all freaking out. The Sh Lord of the Rings hardcover illustrated book is on sale on Amazon, pre-ordered for $40. <gasps> That's cool. Wait, the Lord of the Rings hardcover illustrated book? Can you go buy me that? Sure. Your turn. I want you to buy me that. I will buy you anything you want, Ellen. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Nathan says he has a great question for me. Oh, here Ooh, we go. What Wait. is it? Uh, what is better, chocolate malt or chocolate milkshake? Uh, malts are better. Really? Yep. I didn't know you felt that way. <laughs> Malts are better. I love malt We're powder. We're going to have to have I a love, talk. I love malt powder. I know not everybody does, but I love it. Oh, I have to go somewhere first. Golly. Gator says, okay, Chatter Job is to occupy Randy. <laughs> Leon says, chocolate milkshake. Sorry, Leon. Wrong. Uh, milkshake brings all the boys to the yard, and they're like, dang right. <laughs> better. Yes. <laughs> malt brings 60 to 90% at most. <laughs> I'm gonna go here. Uh, the chat is hashtag cheat distraction. I love it. Our chat is it is weird to ask you guys how old you are? No. No. I am 37. I don't get offended by that question. I'm 37. Just turned 37 a couple of weeks ago. Oh, do you want to reveal your age? I don't remember. You'll be 34. How the heck in a old am I? I'm 33. Yeah, you're 33. You'll be 34 in about a month. I thought or so, I was 32. Yeah. yeah, I'll be 34. Uh, Randy, what city Soon. is considered the birthplace of television? Oh, oh that's a good one. I th Ooh. I think I've I think I've heard this stat at some point. Isn't it like Ohio or something like that? Or uh, well, that's not a city. Um, isn't it like a city in Ohio or something like that? I'll say like Cincinnati. That's so interesting. Hey, team, mom, what's going on? I'm too late. I'll catch you on the replay. That's fine. That's fine. That's still cool, Gator Day. Okay, so it's not, it's not fully, fully illustrated. illustrated. Okay. That's cool. I would still love that. I like Fatal paper. Maper Cut? Oh, my gosh. I'm so tired. Fatal, Fatal Paper Cut cutter? is a malt person, too. A Maper Cutter. Malt powder is such an um, overpowering flavor, I feel. So I have to be in the mood for it. It's not that oh, I don't like it, don't, but like if I'm getting gotta, a malt. You got you to gotta do better with, what? with putting these new cards I up. just replaced this one because you didn't. Oh, that was me. Yeah. Remember before the game, I said you're going to be replacing all of them because you're sitting close. Uh, I remember. Whoppers are my daughter's number one candy. Same as my mom. That's funny. All she right. makes them on the Halloween. Yeah, not a lot of people really want those. I love them. You just put it in your mouth and just kind of suck on it for a little bit and then yeah. that crunch. Oh, then do you ever get like the ones that are like, kind of stale and they're like a little chewy? Oh, I love that. <laughs> I love that. Mm. Fatal Paper Cut is going to be 37 in September. When's your birthday? Mine oh, is September man. 18th. Randy's a puck. Um, Not Ohio. City like name scene. has several letters similar in my name. Oh, Randy. Okay, so. 18 for the 33rd time. Jeez, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, Judy, I don't remember how old I am all the time. That's like a, that's a normal occurrence for me to I have no remember. idea. It's been happening for a I couple give years. up. I give up. Did you go? Yeah. True or false, in Alaska, it's illegal to look at a moose from the window of any aircraft. What <laughs> the heck? Honestly, uh, it's one of those rules that probably I would say real. it's true. I think it's weird <laughs> enough to be true. <laughs> Oh, okay, can I do this? Yet? Rigby, Idaho is the answer. Oh man, Idaho. I wouldn't have gotten to Idaho. I oh, you said Ohio. I said Ohio. Yeah. Mm. Fair, y'all. Okay. Fifty one in two weeks. She is just numbered. Yes. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Rigby, interesting. Okay. <sighs> this is very difficult. Um, I was thinking like Ohio in general as a, you know, kind of like not a very populated area. Sure. So I'll give myself a quarter point on that, which is not You'll enough. Give yourself... I need at least a half a point to win. Give myself a quarter point. Okay. Oh, for pitch's sake. <laughs> Maybe a sixth of a point. I don't like this part. I'm going to get these berries. Those are good berries. Not sure why. Maybe. Okay, and then I'm going to play this... Um, Bird on top of this symbol. Sure. Because I need a beetle and a tree for it. Oh, I you, have what are, you can't snack cut. these. These have to go next to each other. What are you talking about? Oh, I thought I these had. These are to... all ground units. Crane in the mud. You can still put it on there. 
for crying in the mud. All the ground stuff goes on the bottom. Okay, that makes sense. Yikes, wow, look how filled up I am already. This is insane. All right. How do you already have two, <coughs> four, six points on your board and I have two? Because I played vertical cards. Oh! 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 That, does that noise stress anybody else out like crazy? He said it's true. <laughs> what? I, you know what? That actually sounds super duper dupes familiar. Yeah, I feel weird. like I've read something there's weird like that. There's some just weird rules in the book. Uh, let me finish this turn so we're even, and then sure. we will go to the winner. That sound means I won. It's time. <laughs> Ohio is the seventh most populated state. Really? Ohio? Dang. Ohio. Ohio. Man, I really need a dang grassland. I really need a dang uh, reason to do any reason, of this. Reason. Reason. Let's see. One, two. I also need a wetlands, which I don't have Ooh, either. Ooh, that's exciting. All right. Play your dang thing so we can do the thing. I'm going to do this. I'm so excited. I'm going to use that as a three so I can get these three cards. Hey, Ben. What's going on? I got a, okay, this is the one I definitely need. Ben and Brad, are you guys in Ohio? Is that why you're excited? Is there a love for Ohio that I should uh, know about here? Milk, chocolate, reason. Oh my gosh, Steven. All right. And then I'm going to reasons, play this card. Reasons. I love I those reasons candies so much. All right, are we ready? I love, right. yes, I love reasons so, so um, much. Let's see here. How much does Board, then play. this game cost? I want to uh, go to Australia so bad. Retail is 55 Come out, I Dave. <coughs> for this game, which seems high. I mean, first of all, I mean, games are kind of trending more and more because of everything going on. But there are tons of cards in this game, and they all have really detailed, unique art on them. So I'm assuming that most of the reason... Well, this is a little bit more on the more expensive side of like a game of this kind of caliber of being cards and things is because of all of the oh, very extra. Cool. Um, um, the extra they stuff. are in Ohio. Brad Bruso is in Ohio. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. I don't all know much right. about Ohio, actually. Oh, oh stuck oh, in Lodi. Oh, look at all these emails. I'm so excited all that these this emails many people on them. participated. Yeah. All right, I'm just going to just quickly go through, make sure there wasn't any duplicates from my snafu. Snafu. Uh, we, we should totally. We are showing everybody's um, here, so we're all good there. This is awesome, you guys. All right. So I will punch this into the random number generator. Is this going to work? I'm all right, out. there it is. You see that? Yes, I do. Okay. Who is it? So. Should I say it? Can I say it? No. Oh, okay. You can't. Wait, is that correct? I'm so nervous. All right. The winner is of Moonrakers. <gasps> Molly? That's not, right. That's not right. Yes, it is. It said number three. No, this is the one. Okay. You counted it wrong. Oh, okay. <laughs> Molly McKee. Molly McKee. 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 Uh, uh, she's on YouTube as Molly McKee, which is her actual name. Oh, very There very you go. Cool. So, Molly. This is you awesome. are the winner. Winner, winner. Congratulations. Chicken That is dinner. so exciting. Molly McKee. Okay, let's see here. There you go. Ray's putting right. it in the chat. Molly! Yay! Yes! That's so exciting. I love it. That was so fun. We should do these more often. What should we give away next? <laughs> Well, you know, I we have, have a set whole, of dishes that I never use. We Who do wants have a them? whole closet full of games that I was going to sell at some point. So I thought about giving away some of those Let's at some point. Let's do it. Point. It's exciting. Congrats, Molly. Congrats. Very, 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 very cool. Um, so um, I'm just going to shoot you a, a reply email, Molly, to get your um, information at your leisure. Just, you know, within the next few days or so or whenever is fine. Uh, you can send us your um, address that you want it sent to, and we will get that on its way within a few days. Congratulations. <clears throat> You're going to love this game. Um, how many people does it play? Four players, right? It's a four player, up to four uh, players. I think it goes to five. Yep, it goes to five. Two to five. It actually right? has a solo mode and a two player variant. I heard that the two player variant obviously is not super fantastic because it is like negotiation and things like that. But I heard that a lot of people were playing it during the good pandemic because there's Molly. obviously not so many um, <laughs> people playing. But that it's actually a good, it's actually a good enough playable at two player as well. But that's there you go. super exciting. Congratulations. That's awesome. That was a really fun feeling to give something away like that. 
This this game is so good, and it, I think, didn't it actually make my top 10 of 2019? I think it did. I love, I love it so much, so. You win! There we go. So right, there we just it you is back. off to you, Molly. And like I said, just anytime you get a chance in the next couple days is perfectly fine. <laughs> Again, congratulations to Molly. Ellen. That's so cool, Molly. It is your so turn. I'm so excited for you. Okay. That was great. Now this game doesn't seem as fun as that moment. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for real though? Yes. This is going to be a great turn. I'm oh, Molly, you're it. the best. No, Molly, stop <laughs> it. You are. <laughs> oh, Mitch. Oh, that's too bad. Mitch said he typed in the wrong email. Go to the inbox real quick. Can I see something? Nope. Go to the inbox. I will not. We're going to play a game. <laughs> Uh, I don't see Mitch in there. Yeah, Mitch, I don't, I didn't get, I don't see an email from you, Mitch. Yeah, Does, sorry, doesn't look Mitch. Like that you, I mean, obviously you said it didn't go through, but We're Mitch, we will, giveaways. we'll give up more in the, uh, in the future. They're too much fun. That oh, was great. Okay, I have to play this, and I really don't wanna. Oh, you know what? You know what Ooh, I'm gonna VHS. do? VHS. I like VHS. You know what is so cool <laughs> is Molly won this thing. And our chat is so excited for her. I love yeah, seeing everybody be that, like, Mitch. thank you. Yeah, that's, that's like congratulating her. Yeah, it's very nice. Very nice crowd of people. It is. All <laughs> right, I'm going to play my little tabby over here to use the yeah, to play two. ability to play two pads. Oh, two other. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, we oh will give out God. more stuff in the future. We will. So no worries on that. Okay. It just won't be Moonrakers. <laughs> <laughs> Unless Austin decides to give us another one. <laughs> um, okay. So I'm covering up this bird. Yeah. To get out a tree and berries. Tree and berries. And then yep. for my second card, I'm going to play this one, eh? Okay. To get out a flower. Yeah. A flower. Okay, a done. Flower. A flower. Excellent. That was cool. Excellent job, Ellen. <sighs> When Ellen gives her dishes away, you can enter again. I actually right. do a whole stack of dishes. That I think I am going to Mitch, actually I am do super that as well. Can you. you put that over in my notch sure. over there? So I'm going to play two cards. There you go. I'm going to play this tree, and then from there. <laughs> Leon, they uh, are. <laughs> what? You said, were you How did about you getting, know that? You're talking about getting dishes away? Yeah, I was joking. I'm, I said that was fun to give something away. What else should we give away? And I was like, I have a set of dishes. He's like, is that a set your mother-in-law gave me? It actually is. It's just like a white set. Oh, that was like, did she give that when we got married? She gave it to us. Just, I don't remember why. I think it was Maybe she tried married. to sell them at the rummage sale she had. No, no, no. Actually, she had bought, like, they were yeah. on clearance, and she bought a bunch of sets, knowing that, like, you know, people might want them at some time. Cool. So she can give them as, like, housewarming gifts. But yes, gifts. they are from her. So That's funny. They're actually, a, I mean, it was just a plain white set, but they're <laughs> good quality and whatever. All right, second one uh, I want to play is. I would love Honey Buzz 2 better This one, half. these berries. So, since I'm over there, Ellen, I have the berries and the Great. paw print. Can you put that in between there, please? Yes, berries Excellent. and paw print. Thank you, ma'am. I can't tell what that is because <laughs> it's shiny. Okay, so I still have I should give away Honey Buzz because I need that game in my life. We don't even have it yet. I was just telling him that. We won't give it away until we, until we own it. Okay, um... <laughs> I, need, I want some landscape stuff here. <coughs> I want some landscapes, and I ain't got none. Well, you could scry for land landscapes. With this one? Are we no, in the third I can't. Round? No, we're in no, the second round still. All right. I will Keep go losing here. losing track of everything I'm doing. Lori, uh, gotta go. Gotta run and get up at four a.m. for work. Kick Randy's butt. Oh, I will. Boo. I'll boo. totally do that thing. <laughs> Thing that you just said, I will do it. Plus one honey buzz, but you know, we'll just set up for a game topper contest. Yeah, I'm sure you would. I'd okay, love, I'm gonna take I'd this love one. to give one away. I'd love to give everything away. I know that was fun. I just want to give crap away. It's just now. not gonna happen. I'm gonna go through the house and gather a bunch of stuff to give away. <laughs> All right, um, I want to play this elk card. Oh man, you got an elk already? I got an elk already. Yeah. Oh, did you get that in your um, in the north deck? I did. So remember that nothing can go above that. Just so yes. You know. So yes, there's a little X here by the elk head. Two trees. A nothing thing can a go thing. on top of it. Dang. It's worth four points. There's that. Nice <sighs> job. Oh my gosh! Look, at, one of our kids is upstairs on the tablet again. My mom and dad. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Jack, is, is that you? <laughs> That's oh funny. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. I love it. Uh, Jack, yeah. um. Yeah, shipping can be a bear on those things. There's my parents, so I'm not ignoring you, Jack. I see you loud and clear. Now he's laughing. Yeah. He, right. So Jackson, my son Jackson, he's did hijacked. A, he's hijacked it now. Jack, don't. <laughs> 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 yes, I know it's you, Jackson. <laughs> oh, geez. All right. You should remake your intro, but exact opposite with Brandy playing guitar and sitting on a table and ask if they can play. <laughs> And use it to see if people notice. We actually, um, we finally submitted some more videos to Board Game Breakfast. It's been a long time. And we cut a little part out of the intro of Randy asking me. No, no, you said, can we play it? And we cut out my yes, I think. Uh, I cut out the yes just because, I don't know, it's kind of <laughs> lame. <laughs> Loopy saying hi to Jack. All right. Jack, is Wesley in bed now? Might as well ask him here. <laughs> All right, we're gonna take um, this house. Jack is the new star of the show. So Jackson played Pebble Rock Delivery Service with us. It's like a family weight game by Skybound Games. It just came out a few months ago, and we had him here doing a live play. I don't know if you guys remember that, but he play that thinks he's famous now. Jackson, you are famous. You are famous. Yeah, and some, and of, the, some asks, of the kids from school saw him on there, too. Yeah, the kids like, from school, he, he thought it was cool the coolest thing ever. And now he asks if he can be on, like, every live stream we do. <laughs> what, is, what does this mean? Um, what's your favorite game, Jack? <laughs> Let me see, AFK? Oh, thank you, Board Them I don't Play. Know what AFK is. I don't know what AFK is. I so, would have to say his favorite game is Roblox, though. So. Like, computer game, or that's a video game? I think he means... Um, AFK, I don't... Oh, I don't know. I don't know if he's trying to do as far as I know. Jackson, Nathan's asking who know. your favorite Lord of the Rings character is. And what your favorite game is. <laughs> oh, away from keyboard. Oh. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> yes. My son's using all this lingo. Yes. And then we're like, what does that mean? <laughs> it's... Oh, it's suspenseful. Uh, it's what? It's... All right. Is that it? Yeah. All right, so... And my um, son thought he was temporarily these. famous when Cat and Derek mentioned him on Glory Hound channel. It's so cute. I love that. You were on YouTube, Jackson. So famous. <laughs> Parents, sheesh. <laughs> Away from keyboard, sheesh. Yes, yes. So Jackson says I've heard that Frodo. one. It's been a long time since I've played online. <laughs> Dad, you talk to Frodo. YouTubers? <laughs> yeah. I actually didn't know that about Jackson. <laughs> Uh oh, Jackson! Tell us, tell us embarrassing stories about your parents. Oh my god! Oh, so Roblox was say? correct. I thought it would be him and Frodo. I didn't think I knew that. I didn't. Me think famous. I would have guessed Samwise. Gosh, Jackson. Oh. Jackson's probably the biggest ham of the family. He's definitely. My All right, son. so I go. So can you advance? That's us, my kid. Please. All right, like so that? I, yep. <laughs> the thing you just did. Yep. <laughs> As you were telling me to do it. Alright, we're gonna go grab some stuff. We're gonna grab these flowers, these floors. Legolas. Alright, okay, there's Jackson. a grubby. Dominic says hi, Jackson, and he saw Travis playing Roblox earlier. Now it's like all the kids. So Chrissy in the chat is our really good friend, and she has a younger son who comes and plays with my boys. So the chat's turning into the friends hanging out time. <laughs> Bye, Games of Fire. Thank you so much for being here. Yes, thank you for joining us. Awesome. Alrighty. Never mind. <laughs> okay, um, I had a plan and now it's gone. Jackson says, oh, Domazon. <laughs> <laughs> Is Jackson a bigger ham than you guys? I think he might be. Yeah. Absolutely. Gosh, it's hilarious that Jackson came across our stream. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, so we're starting over. So yep. I'm using these thingies. You are. I have a flower. It would be nice to get a paw print. Are there any paw prints out well, there? I have a flower and a paw print currently. So do I. And I'm going to... Oh, are you going to get that all of a well, sudden? Well, since you're going to... Oh, if you're going to make sure that you... Well, I mean, you're two turns away from doing it. So is that what you were going to do on your next turn? Um, I wasn't going to necessarily go there, but if like I see that I you're making it? it... No, since I see that you're going to make a move really? for it, then I'm going to okay. go for it now. That's smarmy. Oh, should I wait? Super smarmy. You're right, I should forego Well, you didn't everything. know that you didn't know that I was going to do it, and then when I said it, you changed your yes, mind. Yes, I am. Mom, the stream was the top thing. <laughs> okay, Jackson, that's enough now. <laughs> you're governing up the chat, Jack. Jack, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> All right, um... So I had a flow... <coughs> I had, add, I had a flow. Don wants you to play Adopt Me on Roblox. 
That's hilarious. Such a beautiful game. Where can we even find it? I keep looking and don't see it anywhere. Um, I don't think it's getting like a bigger release for a little while. Um, on Amazon, they have a pre-order um, for the middle of August. And their pre-orders have usually been pretty good. Um, so I would say maybe go there. All the other online retailers, I saw one at, I want to say, Cardhaus at one point, but those might be sold out. Um, I happened to get this one at my local game store because I, you know, I try to get there, mm. try to go there when I can. I, don't, I go online, obviously, more often than not, but I happened to be there, and I had it, and I picked it up. So maybe um, your best bet might be your local game store. Okay, I think I'll play this and play it right away. Dad. Catch. All right, your turn. <coughs> Me? Yep. Wonder where I, I should I think I go. did that correctly. Oh. Where should I? Where should I go? The Kirby's are privileged people and get games like this this early and tease us. I think it was I pretty it. lucky that you it got was it. Publicly available in our area. Okay. <laughs> Way none special. All right. Yeah, you just happened to get it. At what a really special good time. do I want to use? I kind of need some. Jackson. Enough with the the comments right. now. <laughs> Alright. This oh is kind of a gosh. lame run, but I need some grasslands. Alright. I have acquired a grassland. Grassland acquired. You know what is I'm we're not finding any our um, landscapes. Can you put that there, please. Thank you. You just did it. I know. I realized I could reach it without a problem. Where's all the landscapes? <sighs> you know what I mean? Sure. Where are they? I want to put a house out. Should I scry? I don't even know. Put out a rock house. It's a rock house. Okay, what is my flow? There are you know so what? many games on my list right now. Anyway, so I can can wait. Just it looks so good. I know it's really um, it's really good. It really is. I like it a lot, and the art is fantastic. I'm scrying. Scrying. Um, I don't think I like any of this. Okay. I need a landscape. I'll take that one. Take that Me? One. Yeah. All right. I'm going to go grab that fence. That three-point fence. Three-point fence. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? If a pack of pickled um, peppers was being sold by well, sushi by the seashore. Well, have to chew wood. Otherwise, their it's teeth would get too long. So that's why they chew, uh, to, to wear down their teeth. And uh, Hi, some random dude. Yeah, something like that. Or maybe that's beavers. Oh, that's beavers, isn't it? <clears throat> it's beavers. Beavers have to constantly eat wood to keep their teeth short, which is oh disgusting yeah. if you think about it. All mm. right, I want to play the. Should I play that first? You got no, it, Molly. I gotta play. I'll play this first. This one retrieves a tree. Should I cover up my animal fence? <clears throat> I'm gonna do this one. Boom. Wow. Roasted. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, you're up. Wait. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I couldn't anyways. Never mind. Never mind. <sighs> Good God, I miss my This is very Angry difficult. Beavers. I'm not finding what I like. <laughs> I've ever played Altiplano. Uh, I have actually not played Altiplano. Um, I did want to play it quite a bit. But... Um, I have not actually been had never had an actual chance to play it. Who uh, knows, what is for sheep? Okay, <clears throat> Jack. Meadow is in stock at Spielbound Games online. Well, there you go. <clears throat> okay, I picked that up. No idea why, and I'm gonna play this. And you have a ton of cards in your hand. I know. I, they are not doing anything either. Right. The slabs of slabs of meat with mittens. Um, right, so I can play did these you just two. read this? Meadows in stock on <coughs> Spielbound games. I think I did. heard you say that. Okay. I did. I, did. I kind of would like this game, but doing a no buy August, September till my birthday, but this is pretty. Totally get that. Sometimes, Sometimes you, gotta you just got to chill chill the grill. I mean, we haven't bought any chill new games really. What We bought maybe a couple this year, and then we haven't really bought anything since like beginning of the year or last year or something like yeah, that. Yeah, a really mean, long time. And I mean, then you um, <coughs> bought a ton. For our unboxing video. I did buy a ton, Ellen. You are correct. <laughs> there is a Bigfoot promo for this game I know. on BGG store. There's a big Wait, it's actually promo? on the BGG store? What? I was just trying to find that. 
Maybe okay. I'll have to go there. There you go. Because I saw, says, the, yeah, there's a Bigfoot and there's a couple other promos that I wouldn't mind having. I did not know there was a Sasquatch one. Um, Bigfoot. I have five games on wishlist, five coming soon, but only four outstanding Kickstarters. Oh, that's exciting. I have some super cool geek up bits for Altaplano. Very much worth the upgraded bake light chits from the BGG store. That oh, is man. so fun. I, I love super up games. Yet. Have you seen that spider yet? What? There's a spider. <laughs> Where? Right there. No. Pretty sweet, right? Oh, kind of gave I'm me the chills. grab the spider. Hi, the Curious Box. Cheers from Portugal. Hello. Oh, that's exciting. Oh, $3, three dollars for the promo kit. That's I'm, so cool. I'm gonna buy that. I'm gonna go in there and buy it. Um, I have some super. Oh, so. Dude, oh, you're talking about Orleans bed. Okay, I love. All right, girlfriend. Okay. That explains the cutback on the haul videos. Yeah, we didn't buy anything for a while. Yeah, yes. But now we have a ton of stuff coming in because not only do we do a whole unboxing, but then we actually open those games and go through them. So all yeah, those I really videos will be get coming. Flamecraft, it looks really Flamecraft good is really cool. I got a friend's request from the designer of that game, and we've been kind of chit chatting back and forth. And I would love to try his game out. Bye, Better Half Games. Thank you. No, Better Half Reviews, not games. Yeah, Thank you for being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good luck getting that little one to bed. You're going to need it. Using my next game purchase to motivate me to lose weight. When I lose 30 pounds, I get my next game. Oh, Ooh, that's, a cool idea. that's a great idea. Okay. Uh, I allow myself one Kickstarter per month. I can't control myself at the friendly local game store. Last time I was there, I spent $300 and did the same thing the time before. I know. You see them all sitting there, and they look so dang good. I'm with you there. Yikes. This is not... This is not good. Not good. We have a lot of cards. You can do a doubler. That's not the right one. Oh, what the heck am I looking at? I don't know. Oh. You want the fancy fence, you can get it with your, your random one here or there. That's true, but actually, you know what I might want to do is the double thing. Oh, wait, no, you're saying. trying to get the butterfly. Yeah, it's over there. Yeah. Mm. If I went there, I could play two cards. So I could play... Mm -hmm. yeah, I think I will. I think I'm going to go here instead. So I'll play two cards. So I'll put the, my butterfly on my grab. Okay. And then I will put... My frog on my bait. Oh. Sure. Why, you ask? Because Don't know. you want it. It's because I can do it, so I'm doing it. Why can't I sub to Jackson, you? Jackson. Jack, because you're watching it on our YouTube channel, and you can't sub to yourself. You can't? No. <laughs> if you do the puzzles for Flamecraft, then you can get some promo dragons when you kickstart it. That's really, really cool. And I think he said there's seven dragons, so there's like seven puzzles. I love that. Um, John Wheeler says he had to leave. Looks like he's back now and is asking how we like Meadow. We love this game. I played it. This is my third time playing. It jumped up to my top ten immediately. You're like, I go. love it. I love it. Um, we need to redo our top ten videos. Um, some also, things have changed. since you had to leave, John, the Wii game together is my son Jackson who yeah. came across our stream. And now he's holding <laughs> it. And now he's, he's hijacked it. Now he's hijacked the chat. <laughs> oh boy. I'm gonna put this here. Okay. Which one and are you And I will go ahead and I will take there. um I will take this butterfly. You can't. Why? You can put it over here and take that butterfly. That's what you I keep meant. moving over it. <laughs> A row. And I will put it here. Okay. Alright. Alright, that's it. Alright, that's round three. So you take your stuff back. I guess I should have asked, how do you like it so far? We love it. Yeah, this is our third time playing now. And it's, um, <laughs> it's super good. I like it. All right, so uh, now we're moving across this little line. So that means that all this stuff will go away. <laughs> and they get shuffled and put at the bottom of the deck. <laughs> Some random says, Jackson, what's your favorite game and why don't they let you play? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Jackson's one of our um, board gamer kids. Jackson really likes to board game. Actually, we played Cubitos with him and my oldest son the other day. My eldest? Do you say eldest in that situation? I say that sometimes. Um, and they both loved it. And I think Jack won, too, didn't you, Jack? His favorite game is Roblox. Yes. All right. 
So did you like Quadropolis? How similar are they? The only similar thing about them is this grid thing, how you put these down and you get the thing, the row and the column that it's in. Um, other than that, nothing else about it is the same and I did not like Quadropolis at all. Even with this very satisfying mechanic of choosing from the grid, I love that. That said, I didn't love that game. I never loved it. I just, mm, oh, I man. couldn't. Some, I think Randy really liked it though. Some serious wildlife out here. <clears throat> Do I get to go first or was that? Yep, you're first this round. Nice. Okay. Ooh. All right. Oh, there's a landscape thing. Exciting. So mm. for this one, it looks like I've got only the berries in the tree. That was quite a mission to... Any wolves out? To try to there's get a couple that. of wolves. Or predators. Mm. That's what you need to get to this stuff over here. Yep, I got a frog. I have a house that's not in play yet. And a paw print. Are there any paws out? Two paws and a bird. This is the most engagement from a channel and chat I've ever seen. <laughs> Jackson needs to be in control more often. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell him that. He's yeah, gonna be seriously. <laughs> commandeering the ship. Okay, um, Oof, there's lots of good stuff out there. Is there? I do feel like there is. Um, not a lot of paw prints came out. None came out. Uh, there's not a lot more, there's not going to be that many more paw prints for the rest of the game Ooh, here. this is a good one for me because I already have an elk head. It is a good I one I will get you. that one. Okay. Where's my three? You'll need Actually, more roads to put them down at some point. Yes, so you know. I forgot about that. Okay. So I'm going to take this one because the requirements are something that I can do. Okay. And then I'm playing a card. You can go, I guess, while I do that. Excellent, thank you. Mm. Oh, shoot. All right, this is a good plan. I'm gonna do this. Hmm. Ooh, that's um, tricky. So, I want to put that. Oh, that's gonna go over a house or a fence, eh? Oh, what's that rule where you can get rid of two cards to make something? Uh, just, did you explain that rule before? Oh, I didn't. I don't think uh, you did. I didn't. It hasn't come up yet. But yeah, you can. Um, I didn't mention that. Uh, you can substitute one or more of the requirements for a card by spending two cards of any type out of your hand. Yeah. Um, now, you can do that as many times as you want, but you have to at least fulfill one of the requirements. So say there's three requirements. As long as you fulfill one of those, you could spend four cards to ignore the other two. John Wheeler also never Did liked Quadropolis. That. Did you like that one game, Randy? Quadropolis? Um, I like Quadropolis. Okay. Yeah, I'm not like, a huge fan of okay. it or anything, but you know. Can you tag in chat? You should be able to, Jack. You just start, start typing. So you have to, you can only tag people in YouTube in the YouTube chat, Jack. <laughs> Oh boy! <clears throat> All right. Um, Everybody's giving, telling Jack how to do that. It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get two roads, please. Yeah. I don't know if that, the timing on that is great, but I'm doing it. Sure. So here's my roads. Put that at right wire. All right. I gotta go get that. Um, gotta get that beautiful butterfly. Hmm. <clears throat> All right. Oh, there's a crow. Crow needs a house, a tree, Ooh. a bird, or a frog, and a beetle. All right, so I have two grubs. That's such a cool looking cat. I have two grubs showing. So I will put him there. I played a card, right? No, I went there. Your turn again. Hmm. Okay. We can, but you may never do so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get that hawk. Sure. Wait, that's a crow. Crow. Yeah, it's a crow. All right. And the card that I'm gonna play is gonna be something. Oh, then I would cover my frog. Gold oh, darn it. <sighs> you can play some. Oh yeah. Done. Nice. All right, I definitely want to play this. 
What else do I want to do? Oh, then I will have that. Did you take the cart? Did you take that card? <laughs> oh, you took it. You took the crow. All right. <sighs> um, all right. Butterfly in a tree, huh? That's interesting. I don't have any roads, though. Picket fence. Flower. Hmm. Yeah, I could take that. Two picket fences. Covered up my other picket fence. I probably shouldn't have done that. That was stupid, eh? <laughs> they got that. Tree, toadstool. Toadstool's long gone. Could get that. Man. Yeah. Struggling. <laughs> Struggling. Alright, I'm gonna go for this thing over here. Oh, no. I'm not. <coughs> I know. I'm gonna go for this fence. Fence card. Fence card. Just got a fence card. And then I'm going to play. Ugh, I can't this. take that. Spider. Spider. Uh, Mom, you can't tell animals. Get it right. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh. Um, it can, Loopy, and the more you know the cards in the North deck, <coughs> excuse me, the better off you'll be. And there are a number of cards in the North deck that basically only work off of cards from, like, the South deck, essentially. Like, at least they're easier, like berries and um, <coughs> certain flowers or animals and things. So they're, you kind of want to keep some of those symbols open as much as you can because it'll give you more things you can grab in the north deck. Mmm, dang. Okay. My throat keeps getting really dry. I'm hearing that. Good thing I have water at my ready. Um, golly. Okay. Golly. I'm gonna go here. Okay. You can take, take any card. This one. Which one is that? Oh, are you close to I that, have eh? all of it. Oh, man. It's Get just you. a matter of playing it, which I, can't, I can't take it. I can't play it yet, but that's a game. You can play it right there. Not yet, because I went to the camp spot. Oh, you're Thanks right. for bringing that up. Oh, my gosh. Uh, this game appears to have a fairly small for footprint. It really does. And I was actually going to say earlier, for how, like, kind of small of a game that it is, it's just produced so dang uh. well. These little... Holers. Super close to this one. Look at that. Look how hardcore that is. They're so nice, and they're kind of slanted, too, so the <sighs> cards point upwards. That stinks. Wait, am I doing it right? I keep Isn't getting, that nice? Oh, there's that one, though. And they're the, look at the little cutout there so it doesn't slide around. Just, I love, I appreciate that heck out of that kind of stuff. I really do. <sighs> am I wrong, or does it look like Ellen's way behind? Um... Um, I maybe I probably am. I don't think you're that you're that far behind. Points wise, right. I'm pretty far behind. I can't um, cover. But that. I also have cards up here that you can't see because my. Oh, this can go next to a fence as well. Do I need berries? Oh, I need this berries. This is all mine. Shoot. This is all mine. Does that help? I can't really play any maybe of these. Not. I guess I can play this one. Maybe I'm just need really behind. You need a beetle. Good gracious. When people stop streaming and I making just, YouTube videos, it makes me sad. Yeah. <coughs> I just grabbed a card. We'll have a bunch have of content coming out in the next area. few weeks, so you can keep a lookout for that. Uh, shoot. I guess I can do this. I'll do this. Uh, it makes me sad to do that, but anyway. All right, you're up. Did you have a butterfly in a tree? This one's great for you. I can't grab it. I almost did, but I chose a different one. What do you have left? I, I got it. I got this. I got I this. I want to see what you have. It's a four. Sorry. <sighs> um... <sighs> keep wanting to get my house down, but if I do, then I'm covering my frog, which took me forever to get. Do you need the frog? 
There are a bunch of things that require frogs. I need a frog <coughs> for this one, mm -hmm. so I don't want to cover it up. Dang what about the uh, rock house? I have that exact thing, but it only requires one card. So well, then like... you can stack them. You can play the one rock house and then play the double rock house on top of it. I guess that's true. Is that a good move? I have no Of course idea. it's a good move. It gives you points. Anything that gives you points is a good move, Ellen. Randy, you were just humming Celine Dion with a rock twist. <laughs> 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 Oh, wait. Okay, I was going to play this one. All requirements match. Nice. What do I put on these now, on top of them? You put these package icons. That's why package I'm pointing at those and icons. saying that this one would be a good one for you. <clears throat> I have package icons. Take this one. Oh, okay, I see. All right, all right, all right. There's Ooh. Another, there's another rock house. I need a beard. Right, where do I want to put this one? Oh, look at this fantastical creature. Put that right here. Yep. You should show Chrissy this real quick. <coughs> That's the jackalope. Jackalope. Did you see this one, Chrissy? This is part of the fantasy pack. Look at that. Oh, oh my <laughs> gosh. It reminds me of Thorn Ogres of Hagwood, this book that I used to read when I was a kid. All right, your turn. The Wurgle Creatures. No, we're, we're done. Oh. Are we? Okay. So this goes here. Yep. We, we got two more back. rounds left. And actually, if you know this game well and you just get cooking, you can whip yeah, that game right out. To, and you don't have to worry about, you know, appeasing chat. <laughs> <laughs> we love doing that. All right. What's, What's our out favorite there? part? So toadstool. Hmm. Wolf. I oh. can't yeah, place we wanna, either we of those. Wolf. The wolf, the wolf, the wolf is on fire. I think I want that lynx. I don't have a bird, though. Mm. I don't have a frog, either. There's lots of things Ooh, I also don't have. I do have a have. cat. I can get the cat. Should I scry for birds? I wonder if I should scry for birds. I need birds. Right. Oh, dang it. I would have taken the wolf. Actually, two of these cards that I yeah, have stinks. I require the wolf. birds. I need to scry for a bird. Right, I'm, I'm going to do this. I'm going to put this out and cover something. I'll cover the spider. Turn. Oh. No, I'm not going to scry yet. I'm going to take this sucker. This little baggie. I need a landscape, a butterfly, and a tree. And I have all of... Great. It. Play so right away, play too. Play it right on there. <coughs> How pretty that is. Look what I found out in the wood. I don't know All what that right. is, but it's holding a crystal. So I can get that. <laughs> you don't have any of those at, right? No. Any what? So if I get oh, that one out, which I can shoot. get out kind of whenever, so it's, I got time for that. Sometimes it's so unfortunate when you cover something that you really need and then you gotta work your way back up to getting it again. Oh, yeah. that's such an icky feeling. Ah. But it's still beautiful. All right. Birds. Oh, there's a bird out there. Do I have two fences? I don't have two fences. I keep covering fences. Um, I think I'm gonna take the fantasy jackalope. Hmm. I think. I would need a bug, though. I can get a bug, but is that worth it? I mean, to get a card to play another card? Only Probably you can not. Tell. Probably you can not. Tell. I don't know how many froggies. I can't play any of these big-time cards. Oh, oh, oh. Wow, look at what Nathan said. It appears that Shem Phillips announced two expansions for Viscounts, Gates of Gold and Keeper of Keys. <gasps> That's awesome. Oh, there's the first hawk. Nice. Team Distraction works better with Jackson. Love it. Ours are too young still, but they are interested in joining the chat. <laughs> That's so cute. Guys, are you hyped for the Lord of the Rings show? This is what Jack says. <laughs> <laughs> Jack, I am super hyped. How did you like that picture, Jackson, earlier that I showed you? Are you done? Um, yeah. Are you done yet? Now are you? Yeah. Did you just finish? I think I can cover... Do I have a two? Oh, I'll cover a tree. I'll cover this tree over here, I guess. Oh, 
I need a dang bird. I don't know if that was a good idea. I don't know. I don't want to keep my doubles open just in I'll case. I'll take ground territory and play a house on top of it. Or, no, that's not right. I place it first. That's right. Take it. Play it. Take it. Take, take it. it. Take play it. Take it. Okay. It's the best uh, graphics ever. Frog. Bird. I don't really need a bird. I desperately need a bird, actually. But it has, right I know, there. it has stuff on it that I need to rebuild back up. Mm -hmm. So it's like, is it even worth it at this point? There's only a round left. I'm going to play two cards. I need two cards. I can get, get the stuff in my Air Force ones. All right, um, can you put my last token on here, please? Yeah, I'd love to. Look at that. Another game where I get none of them. <coughs> Why is it literally impossible for me to fill those in? Well, you need a bird of prey. I've never been able to do though. I think I did Any one chance. in a game There's before. There's a bird of prey, which is pretty rare, so you might want to. It's, I, it's got paw prints. I don't have paw prints. Oh. Yeah, it's kind tough. of at this point of the game, and there's one round left. No. All right, so I am so going Ray's to gonna play two cards. So going to destroy me from this cards. alone. You have to be able to put your pieces I'm in. Play here. a tree. Wait, no. I'm gonna play the um, that, and then I'll play the tree on top. One card in my hand. What roared the rings? It's the best graphics ever. Yeah, they're making one um, for uh, Amazon. So on September second, twenty twenty two, they say the first episode on Amazon should be um, be out. I'm not sure that I'll ever watch the new Lord of the Rings, but the first episode of the new Masters of the Universe blew my mind. Well, you should watch Lord of the Rings. Oh, and Why then Jackson said, um, "Go for Dad." That's right. Okay, your turn. <clears throat> Dad's the best. I probably shouldn't have used that. All right. Oh, well. That's all right. No, it's not. How did yes, this card is. go away? Oh, that's the one you just used. I have no idea. Hi, Dan Hopper. Finally got it on a live Dan? stream. So who's winning? Randy's clearly winning. Actually, this is a frustrating thing that I don't like about this game. Okay. These can be very hard to get throughout the game, and if you don't start working on them right away, it... But that's a lot of points for somebody. I don't be. like that. You're right. you I don't, don't like that. that. No, I've never been able to squeeze getting things into <laughs> there, and it's super frustrating. I don't like that. Fence and the beetle. Um. So yeah, I'm sure Randy's gonna win this one. Definitely. Yeah. If I get a fence and a beetle, I could do that, but I don't want to. I am gonna do this one. <clears throat> House and berries. I'm gonna put that right on top of my other berries. Turn. Do you have a house yet? Yeah, you get a house. Look at this. I mean, it's kind of blocked currently, but you could well, use that this. one to get any of them. Yeah. Is that what I want, though? I don't know. It's three points. You have a lot of cards. You could easily be like dumping two cards I'm to make sure up how. for. I'm not sure how. Like I know you explained it, but I just kind of gave up. So, what card would you want to play potentially? Um, I want to play these two for show. Well, those you can just play, right? Yeah. So you asked what I want to play. Those okay. are what I want to play. Right. Well, then maybe you should be using that as a four, so you can play a couple cards out or something. That's what I was. That's what I was going to do this turn. Mm -hmm. And then you showed me that. Well, you want to maximize like, well. your points if possible, so you'd want to put three pointers down there if you can. Um. But if you can, I can't. can't. All right. Well, you can discard two cards to get that to get that missing piece. What's your biggest card in your hand? Okay, so that needs a house that one. and a tree. <laughs> if you think you lose, you lose. A got, frog. Lose. Look, so the only Let thing the you don't have win. here is a bug. You can play yeah. this by discarding any two cards from your hand. But I thought I... Oh, because I you have to just have one of the things? No. You have the house, you have yeah. the tree, you yeah. have a frog. Yep. The only thing you're missing is this one. Okay. So to to ignore that, you could play... You could discard two cards along with that card and play it. Dang. Okay, so I will get rid so that's of... That's what you need to get other bird things. You said you had other th bird things that you were waiting on, right? Yeah. Ugh. So don't discard stuff you'd want to play. I'll get rid of these two then. Okay. Oh, right? Am I doing yeah. this right? Mm-hmm. And then you can put that on your house, your frog, or house. your tree. Okay. There you go. Wow. But you wow. have to like 
you know, go somewhere to play something. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's um, like on here somewhere. Oh, my gosh. That's hilarious. <laughs> okay. Cool. Jackson asks, you liking the live stream? Gosh, he's telling people to like the live stream. <laughs> Jack's like our manager. Remind Get me to watch it in September 22. Oh, we will certainly be touting its glory in oh, September. Oh, I cannot wait. So, Jack said, the deal is when mom wins, she has to buy you Dairy Queen if you root for her. <laughs> and if dad wins, he has to play Roblox. Or hey, that's, I actually <laughs> like that. I'd, I'd rather not to play the video games. Randy, some advice for you. Let the Wookiee win. <laughs> yeah. If you think you'll lose, you lose. But yeah, probably. <laughs> Uh, do you ever get to play any Lord of the Rings games? And then Jax is like, everybody likes a vid. Do it now. Guys, like the vid. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Love the vid. <laughs> okay, Jackson, that's... Oh, my gosh. gosh. Jax are a little... Uh, oh, man. Jax are a little ambassador, apparently. He is. All right. So yeah, I have berries. I have those. Don't have a toadstool, but... I just, I feel like I have, I don't know. Why am I not getting, why am I not getting things out? Why not do things? I'm going to try to get this thing here. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll come across it at some point. Mm -hmm. There's another bird of prey. Do you have double birds? You have a single bird. You have a single bird. But you could I discard could. two cards to get him out. And if you did that, and you have berries, you could get this. Okay. All right. You have one more turn. Hmm. Um. <laughs> Dairy Queen. <laughs> Jack, you go for Jack's ice cream cake right now. Jackson's a fantastic hype man. That's hilarious. <laughs> Should I use this for scrying? Um, you could. Scry the north deck. Maybe you'll That'll get something. <laughs> I like scrying because I like the word sky. What am I looking for here? Maybe another bird? Uh, don't you get money for people watching the vid? <laughs> gosh, Jackson. <laughs> yes, Jackson, we do get a little bit of money. We do, that. actually? Yes. Oh my gosh, what the heck? <laughs> not a lot, I buddy. That. It's not a lot. <laughs> um, shoot. Yeah, no, none of that works for me. But... Oh, I grabbed the card and I didn't play anything. But I, I, don't, I can't actually play anything, so let's... Part of the reason, I guess. <laughs> All right. Whew. Done. All right. All right. So we go into our last round. Yep. Almost <laughs> done. And then, last uh, round. did you take the first player just now? Nope. Oh, thanks. All right. So I think I will get that one that we discussed. Okay. And I want to play it right away. I have a bird, so I needed to... I Are you planning on getting more roads by the end of the game? No. You might want to use the two, then, because this one will let you take a card oh, from anywhere. Right, 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 so right. you might, you know, if you come right. across something you specifically yeah, need. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm going to discard this. Okay. Do it. And I'm going to discard this. Uh, three people birds. left the live stream. Okay, Jack, thank you. Jeez. <laughs> three people left. All right, cool. Done. All right. I need berry. Or Thanks no, for being here. Board them. Play. I need a toadstool. There's not really any toadstools out. <laughs> I, you know what? Our counter is not working, so I have no idea how many people are here, actually. Ooh. That's our Bobo's here. Where would Ellen be in this game without Randy's help and the bonus 20 points she gets from me being here? Absolutely. You know what? I'm going to tell you something right now. That's our Bobo. I'm going to need that tonight because uh, I don't know what's going on. I kind of need a toadstool. Definitely don't, don't have a lot cards. of high-scoring stuff. Shoot. Do I scry Hi, Chicago for, Twilight. Scry for a toadstool? Been a while. That's not a good plan, right? Very cool. Leon's screen says 21 on YouTube. Well, that's cool. Oh, that's good. That's awesome. Yeah, I love when our counter breaks. It's just fun to know. It's just fun to know um, because cause why wouldn't you want to know? But it's not working. Um, Shoot. 
You know what's kind of killer for me is... Oh, wait, I, I get really that. I really want to do this, but I think I went after Ready, to. I get to use it. I'm going to scry for... Or no, I have to go there. I'm going to scry for a flipping toadstool. I think I have to actually go there. You do. Yeah. Come on, toadstool. Shoot. <gasps> I got a toadstool. What are the flipping chances of that? Scrying is awesome. It helps. I will play the said toadstool. Hmm. <clears throat> I'm a wetlands expert. I have three wetlands. <laughs> Hello, Chicago. Only one person didn't like the bit. Oh, jeez. Gosh, Jackson. <laughs> I'm glad you have our well-being at heart, Jack. I'm going to go here. Okay. You going to scry? What are you scrying? <sighs> um, I don't know. Really, I just want to get this thing filled in. Oh, okay. So, well, um, if you don't really have any cards in here, I would say your north deck is your best bet. Yeah, I think so. Sorry for being nice, he said. <laughs> I just think it's funny. Can't, 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 or could. won't. I could use that one. That's a good one. And then, because I went there, I get to put my two points... There you go. Around the campfire. Yay. Um, Two points wait. to Randy's you need a, seven. Do you have nope. a wolf? Nine. Do you have a, so there's a lot of wolf ones out there. I know. The requirements are ridiculous. There's yeah, no but you can spend two cards oh, wait, to what get are we... rid of stuff. Remember? Like this oh, one. Oh, that's true. Why do I keep forgetting I can do that? You can, get, you can get that and get rid of two cards. Why do I keep forgetting it? I don't know. Hmm. All right. <sighs> The guilt, the guilt, Toadstool. I have to click like. What thank thank can, you. Um... <sighs> oh, hi, Chicago Toilet says they're usually there just lurking. So I'm glad you spoke up and said hi. Lurk away, my friend. Lurk away. Lurk away, lurk away, lurk away. Lurk away, lurk away, lurk away. I don't really like all of those cards, to be honest. I feel like I need to scry the deck as well. It's worked out for me almost every single time I've scryed. Would you? Would that be called all screw? The, like so many of them need like um, two paw prints, which I covered one of mine up, and then they need, like frogs and crap. Can you throw stuff away like I did? I guess I could get a worm. See, this game starts getting thinky towards the end. I know. It starts so light and airy, and then you're All like, right. wait a minute. We're going to we're gonna go over there and scry again. Scry, scry, wow, scry. Oh, if I do you. this, it takes away your ability to get anything. I'm sorry. If that helps you. If that hinders you. It annoys me. Um... <laughs> that song gets my leg. <laughs> Here we go. Lurk away, lurk away, lurk away. That's super creepy. Oh. All right, I'm going to play this bad boy. I'm super annoyed that you went there, Andy. Thank you. Do I need fences? I'm almost out of turns, right? Mm. I feel like... I don't know Are you just fences. playing something right now, or should I Yeah, no, I'm, Yeah, you can go. This um, is deciding where I wanted to put this. Um, right, we're going to go there. Um, uh, okay. Um, starting, oh, can I, uh, okay, Randy, can you name that song and the artist? Sail Away, Sail Away? That would be, uh, it's called Sail Away, and it's by, um, the Celt Celtic Woman, right? Or they just sing it. I don't know who actually, um, they probably didn't. It's not Celtic Woman. Um, they sing it, though, Thought don't they? you knew everything. Oh, jeez. They sing it, though, right? I think I they wrong? do, they do sing it, yes. But isn't it by Net Nenya? Nenya? Is it by Nenya? Nenya? Interesting. <laughs> My kids are singing after all. <laughs> Two trees. Uh, I just got rid of a tree, so that ain't gonna happen. Bring the Glenn Miller up in here. <laughs> that that tune is so fun to do. Love it. 
I used to hum that all the time as a kid too for whatever reason. I don't yeah, really Parent want, Trap, exactly. I really oh, I don't love want it. one point cards, but I think I want Oh my gosh, the um them. the Lindsay Lohan one. I mean I love the um oh what's her name? Shoot. The Pollyanna. Shh. The girl who plays Pollyanna. Haley Mills, Haley Mills. I love the old Haley Mills one. Grew up with that one. But I also grew up with the uh, the Lindsay Lohan one. I just think it's such a cozy movie. Like it's very nostalgic. What? All right. Oh, you're right. Go here. Orinoco Flow. Yeah, I think you're right, Chadley. Absolutely. All right, your turn. Oh, look at this. Okay, I want to say hi to Sadie and Bria. Hi, Sadie and Bria. How Hello, are you Sadie. guys tonight? Tonight for us. Yeah, you guys. <laughs> in, they're in Canada. That's the nerd shelf, so it's nice yeah. for them. Hello, Sadie That's and so Bria. cute. <laughs> Hope you guys are having an awesome <laughs> night. Enya. Oh, you know what? Okay, Enya is, is the name of the Enya. group. I said Nenya, because oh, Nenya. that's Galadriel's ring. <laughs> I, I, I immediately <laughs> heard Enya when you said it, though. Yeah. Galadriel is the ring bearer of Nenya, and I get those wrong all the time. And actually, Enya does some of the songs for, on like the Lord of the Rings soundtracks. Yep. That's you're funny. Up. Are you up? Yep, you're up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I will go thus. Thus. And I will take... Thus. Something else. Can you get him played in the next turn? Nope, I'm just taking it. You should take something you can play. I can't play anything. That's too bad. I, I actually can't. Can you play cards in your hand? Oh, you can't play the mm -hmm. double four. Yeah. And now you can't get to play. play a there's card. nothing out here you can play. Um, seems crazy. Like, I mean, you can like discard stuff to like potentially play stuff. No, I don't have an open thing for that. Only one bird, no paw prints. But like this one, you can play that one by discarding two cards. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. Right. Oh, that's talking, what I was going to do, and then you covered it, and so that's why I, I didn't forgot. Cover it. Oh, it's that's so cool. Literally as open as it can possibly be. That's cool, Judy. <laughs> I'm so glad they're excited that we called out their names. That's so cute. Me? Nope. You got to play a card, right? So you should do that. <clears throat> this one. Because why not? It's three points. Miller did In the Mood, which Ellen was humming, and Moonlight Serenade, yes. What card did you play? That one. There you go. So this is your last play. So play your most expensive card you can. Okay. They're all used to play the Middle Earth, Middle Earth collectible card game, and Gladiator was the best card in my collection. I'd like to play that. That sounds cool. I mean, this is horse apiece. They're all freaking. They're all three points. Can't do that one. So any of these, it doesn't matter. So I'll get rid of these two to play this one. Okay. Sweet. Last turn. That was it. Well, you still have. You don't meet either of these requirements. Berries. Oh, berries. I'm sorry. You're right. All right. Chadley says, now you guys need to start putting the songs played in the show at the end of the credit. That's hilarious because we actually do go through We sing a lot of songs on these streams. We should probably start. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> you know what, right. Nathan? I would love to have a sweetheart to dance to Moonlight Serenade. Randy and I tried anything? dancing. We took dancing lessons. Randy and I took, for Christmas, he bought me a package of dance lessons at Fred Astaire. And we went, and it was not quite what we thought it was going to be. Super fun. And we learned, like, a couple of, just a couple moves, but I am I know myself, and I'm pretty sure I forgot the moves already. I have a which beagle, is kind of right? sad. Oh, no, I don't have a beetle. I never played it. <laughs> Shoot, that would have been nice. I should have played the beetle. Should have played the battle. <laughs> Strong. Best put the, so the song yeah. title at the end, or suffer copyright hell from the YouTube. From YouTube. Yeah, seriously. Uh, um, bug, beetle, tip frog. Tiptoe through the tulips. Oh, I know that one, too. Oh. All right, none of these help me. So I'll get this one. 
Nathan, that's totally it. Your problem is that you both want to lead. The guy then, teaching us um, was like, kept telling me, like, stop leading. Let him do it. And I kept pulling Randy around the floor. Oh, All right, that is game. Hey, TJ Holgerson. So All glad right. you're here. We just ended the game and meet, like right this second. <laughs> Oh, oh, right. This yeah, is you don't want to pathetic. use that sweet average all 20 cents. That's right. I know. It's not a lot. It's not a lot. All right. So uh, now you just count up all of the points on the cards in front of you, along with any of the campfire points you have there. And that uh, determines the winner. I would love to do the learn to dance from home. We actually kind of looked into that. I think that's a great idea. Yeah, so the scoring is kind of cool. Besides these campfire ones, the only points are on your cards. That's it. And I kind of love that. So here we go. Sixty. Okay. I, I, I tied need, my I tied my best score. I need my calculator. I think. Unless you want to, no, I'll do it. I can do it. Oh, I got it. I got sixty. So what do you got here? Forty-five. I got forty-nine. You got forty-nine. I count. I count forty-nine on your cards. Oh, forty-nine. So it's two, five. Oh, I forgot about seven, those. Seven, ten, thirteen, sixteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-six, twenty-seven, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-three, mm. thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-eight, forty-one, forty-five, forty-seven. We went from 44 to 49 to 47. Did it say 49? Yeah. Um, I've never scored I well in this game. Okay, so. here's, here's the thing. I've never scored well in this game. Nowhere close to winning it. It's still so fun. I love this game. Winning <laughs> is important for me. I'm sorry. It just is. Um, but it, this is such a great game. But I, I don't... I feel like there is a strategy what it is. I have yet to unearth it. No idea what I'm doing wrong in this game. But I think, what was my highest score? 40? Um, Probably 47, 47 what I scored tonight. I yeah. think that was my highest score. Um, yeah, there Christy, it is, guys. Meadow. Christy scored 61 on her first play. I got 60 for the second time in a row. <coughs> Excuse me. That was very close. Um, that was very close to who you, yourself. <sighs> I was like close, one close symbol away from being able to drop two cards to play a, a four pointer. Which obviously Let's didn't see, 47. work out. I would have gotten 50 had I been able to go there. And then he's like, oh, I, I'm sorry. Does well, that take your spot? I yes, have it covered does. covered this one. Oh, no, I maybe didn't have that one available. If I would have covered this one, no. No, I don't think it would have had it. Should have, could have, would have made. So, what do you guys think? Is it the vibe you thought? Is it the the weight Good you Good job, thought? Mom and Dad. Thank you, Jackson. What are your thoughts on this game? Um, I love it. I think it's fantastic. This is my third time playing it in like three days. And I'm I'm not yeah. sick of it no, yet. It's, I'm not it's sick a, of it yet. I like this one a lot. The replayability is obviously look at all these cards. There's a million. And then also per amount of players you have these little um, pieces come out here. And um, they constantly give you new ways to score here in the middle around the campfire. So that's replayability. It's just... It's cozy as heck. Um, the other two times that we played it, we were outside, you guys, on a gorgeous yeah. summer day. Yep. And it, you could just, all oh, the breeze, it's and we had better. snacks outside. It's even better when you're amazing. playing outside. Amazing. Cool. I'm looking up the Board Game Geek. Yeah, yeah they the have heck it. Are you? There it is. Bigfoot. What is that? That's oh, Bigfoot. That's I need so it. cool. <gasps> Look at him in the background. I know. That's it's really, the, really cool. Oh, there's I a love couple this other. One. There's a couple other. Um, promos as well. Do they have any of the other ones? We're currently looking at a picture right now. I don't know if you can share the screen or if you don't want to do that. Um, I can't do it in a oh, quick fashion. It. So we're looking at the promo card that. of the Bigfoot um, Meadow. That's really, really cool. Yeah, I like that one. Anyway. So the Sasquatch, how he walks like this, and then yeah. all the pictures, he's in the background doing that. <laughs> Uh, great. Uh, Let's see here. Great game. I like the flow of the game. Um, have great rest of the night. Bye, guys. Goodbye, Mirren. Thank you. Thank for you so much, Mirren. See you later. Uh, better than I thought. Not sure I would buy. I need to try it with the wife. Yeah, I think that um, she would love it, and you should just buy it. Leave. <laughs> <laughs> Advice from us. Just uh, Valerie buy. says seems pretty chill and pretty with some thinkiness. Yes, it's got some thinkiness without being like too crazy. 
And, you know, you have to think ahead a little bit, but you yeah. don't have to think ahead more than, like, a couple of turns. Um, um, it's nice to be nicer if Alan when I agree, Nathan. I hmm. did forget. I, oh, actually, that was this was the first game that I actually tossed cards to be able to make up for, you know, a, a, a tag that I'm missing. That's super convenient. Yeah. I should have done that a million times. Because I always end this game with, like, a bunch of cards left over. You I usually have a lot again, of cards though. left over because you, you, you go there again? a lot, which is not always great. Jackson. <laughs> um, oh, my like gosh. Mom looking in my soul. Okay, Jack. Now you're just getting weird, bud. It's time for bed, buddy. <laughs> time for... Actually, it is 1030. Yeah. They what the heck be, are you... I don't know why our kids are going to bed later. What the heck are you up for so late for, Jack? Get in bed, son. <laughs> Good night, Beyond Dead. Guys, thank you so much for being here. Yeah, thank here. you everyone for joining us. The, um, um, congratulations again, Molly. Right, Molly? Yeah, Molly McKee. Yes. That was uh, very fun. For winning fun. Moonrakers. Yeah, Congrats. it makes me want to give a lot more stuff away. Congratulations. It's, so, it's fun to be the bearer of fun giveaways. <laughs> I like that. It is fun to give stuff away. Yeah, definitely. I'm, I'm a fan of it, so we'll do it more often. All right. Good night, Valerie. Thank you so much. Good old times. Time is ten twenty. So what do we we got playing this a little after eight? We got it was eight thirty. Eight thirty. Yep. So. Good night, Chicago two Twilight. Hours? What does it say for playtime on this bad boy? <laughs> the mother in law's dishes. Sixty to ninety minutes. Obviously, we were distracted quite a bit from chat. Plus, we had that whole interlude of the Moonraker. So yeah, we were right about that hour and a half. Absolutely. Right? right about that time. I don't like frame. distracted by chat. We got to think <laughs> of a new way to say it. We were um, engaged uh, with chat. Yeah. Chat engagement. I love that. So exciting. Good night, guys. Thank you, Molly. That was awesome. So glad you won the game. Excited. Yes, congrats. Thanks for being here, Judy. Um, I got your email, uh, Molly. So, yeah, we'll be sending that out in the next couple days for you, for sure. 140 minutes, says Nathan. Perfect. 140 minutes. 140. Oh, that's yeah. how long we've been on for. Yeah. But that's not how long we've actually been playing. Busy for. chattering. Yeah, I like that, too. Something something other than distracted. Stream tomorrow, Ellen? I don't know. We'll see. Um, I have... I was just talking to Glory Hound about it, and we're not sure if we're on for tomorrow yet, so it's going to be a last-minute decision. So we'll... I'll let you know. But uh, making friends, yes, that's it. Not distracted by chat. Making friends. Look at... That kind of goes together. Oh. Not quite, but kind of. That looks like an oval. All right. Anyway, <laughs> uh, yeah, thank you, everyone, for joining us. Uh, Ellen, yeah, you're, I think you're streaming, right, with Gloria? Well, we're going to call. We'll see in the morning. Oh. I don't, I'm not sure yet. All right. I don't know. Uh, can I be the stream again, please? Um, I guess so, Jack. Uh, yeah, no, we'll, we'll have you. Oh, you mean like actually playing the game? He wants to be on the stream again because he was uh, famous that yeah, one time. Yeah, Jack, you can be on the stream again soon. Kid is my can son. I? Kid is my son. <laughs> More stream from him. That's right. Everybody loves you, Jack. You're a celebrity. <laughs> uh, All right, guys. Thank you again for joining us. And uh, I think we'll, we'll wrap it up, right? Yeah. All right. I think so. Thank Good you game. guys again. Uh, join us on the next one. Next Monday, we're live streaming again. I think yeah. I might. I don't know if I have time this week, but I might try to slip a solo play in this week. If not, probably next week. So yeah. within the next couple weeks, I think I'll try to slip a solo play through. Yeah, Randy's um, been uh, thinking about doing some solo streaming. Now, would you do that? When would you do this? Because are you saying live? You would do yeah, like, like when a, I get home from work so at some point. Oh, like an evening. Okay. Yeah. I thought maybe like a Saturday afternoon. I, or I might throw one in on a Saturday or Sunday as well. That's cool. Yeah. I support it. So. That's great. All right, guys. Thanks again for joining us, and uh, we will see you on the next one. Bye, guys. Goodbye. Bye.